Start the recording. Hi, VODs channel. We've been say we've been on a vo high VODs channel streak, so we better keep it going. Uh, I appreciate you guys. But anyway, uh, today we're going to check out the Mortuary Assistant once again. We're going to replay it from the beginning, going to completely reset our save file and get all the endings in one sitting. It's going to be a lot of fun because I think this is like my personal favorite horror game of, the of this year. And I really want to see more horror games like this. Look, we got all the endings and we're going to... Uh, should I click new shift erase data? I should let's just click. I was gonna click that when we start the video I think that's fitting. So let's go say hi YouTube to the main channel <laughs> There's so many channels going on and here and there you can say hi to the clips channel when you think something cool happens You can just say hi clips uh, put me in the clip the big handsome. Thank you for the 10 <laughs> 10 gift subs. Thank you. All right. Anyway, let's go One second Hi YouTube, how are you doing? And welcome back to the Mortuary Assistant. If you've watched the series that we did on this game, this game is absolutely incredible. I think it is by far my favorite horror game of the year. And I really, really want to see more horror games like this, which is why we are going to do a brand fresh spanking new playthrough of this game from start to finish right now we're gonna erase our save data and just start from the very beginning experience all the endings once again experience all the spooks it's gonna be an absolutely incredible time i love this game i really want to see more games like this which is why we're gonna play it again so i hope you join us if you're not subscribed please do so if you like the video like it if you just like it just like it but let's not waste any more time and let's click this big scary button right here that says erase data Warning, deleting your save data will d reset the entire game. Erase. New shift. Boom. Let's go. <laughs> Press the big scary button. Captain Obvious, thank you for the 10 gift subs. Oh, baby. I'm so glad it's almost over. Congratulations, sweetie. <laughs> thank you. I'll never understand why you chose such a macabre field. There's nothing but... disturbing about it. It's just but that I... I'm proud of you. I really am. You've come so far. A story. So the, that is the character we play as, by next? the way, the lady on the left. Will you get a job where you are, or they actually have everyone they need. But my old teacher, Mr. Delver, transferred me to his office to the lore. finalize my internship there. Oh, well, that's good. I remember you mentioning him. Where's he located? Are you moving away from me? <laughs> no. No. Why are you I'm not moving. He's actually like located around here. Rebecca. Riverfields. Oh, Rebecca. I don't like that. Grandma. Even I've heard things about that place. I'd just be worried people about you. make up stories. Death is a scary thing to a lot of people. And we try to explain things we don't understand, and we want comfort when we lose someone we love. I mean, no one's embalming any ghost bodies or whatever. It's fine. Wait, um, wait. <laughs> Sorry. Foreshadowing. But Sometimes I foreshadowing was fairly to obvious. Give you this anyway. So, here. There we go, the lore. This is very important, but we didn't know it at the time I, how I important this item that. is. Just take it. You please. need it. Please take it. it. Should be yours anyway. She doesn't know. She doesn't know. This item is gonna save our life. <laughs> Thanks. But all right. Thanks. Enough spooky stuff. I'm so proud of you. When is all this happening? When do you start? I've actually been there for a few weeks now. My review is tomorrow. Spoiler alert, let's go. Zerg Muncher, thank you for that two months. Oh boy, here we go. Slark Chant, thank you for the sub as well. I'm so excited. <laughs> I love this game. Riverfields Mortuary. Here we are. Experience it all again. Yeah, this is all, this is made by a single dev, by the way, which is insane. Also, there's been updates, by the way, that have added new right. creepy events as well as new bodies, go. I think. So there's lots more stuff to uh, uncover as well that I have not seen yet. Misty, thank you for the sub. All right, here we go. We are such pros now. Rebecca, one last thing I forgot to give you. Please grab a pencil from my desk and sign. Yes, I will do that. Oh, click the buttons. Thank you. Yes. Sign the thing. I can interact. Boom. Pencil. I've done it. Is the guy here? I think the guy is here, right? Rebecca. There he is. Great. Perfect timing. 
I just finished with Mr. Dalton here. Please wheel him back to cold storage and bring us Mrs. Page. Hello. Are you a demon? I know how to move the deceased. Oops. Focus mode activated. I don't actually remember what happens on the first night because this only happens once. Uh, cold storage. I know how that works. We're professionals. Probably, yeah, okay. I need to open it up though. Does this actually work? Oops. And goodbye, sir. Back to back to your place you're going. We need to get Mr. Mrs. I forgot the name. The immersion. Mrs. Dorothy Page. Hi there. How are you doing? What are the names this time? Are we gonna find another Tony Pizza? Tony Pizza was a legendary name. And we did suck really bad when we first played this game. Like, I kept doing the wrong body. There were so many people in the comments that were like, You're so bad right. at this game, I'm, I'm gonna become the Joker. I'm just finishing up here. <laughs> so why don't you grab the clipboard and start recording identifying marks? Yes, I will I'll look get for up. them. Oh, I'm your speed way running. Done and let you hop in here. I'm, I'm uh, looking at the bo- Oh my god, there's legs though. Those are- Hmm. <laughs> <laughs> These old windows never stay latched. I have no- I forgot everything that happens on the first night. <laughs> I'm on edge, man. Oh, there you are. And is there something on your back? Rotate. There's something on the back. Is that it? Oh, arm. Leg. I don't see anything on the leg. Maybe on this uh, arm on the other side. Yes, Great. Indeed. Climb on in here and put everything into the record system. I will. Don't forget to take the printout to the front desk so Zoe can add it to the packet for the family. After that, we'll get started. Look at you. Look at you, sir. Yes. I will... Oh, I used to... View clipboard with space is still on the screen. I should probably do... What was that? I didn't say anything. You alright? Yeah. I'm fine. Sorry. Don't die here? Excuse me. Um... This person actually lived we need to pay attention to these ages because this person actually lived like no, a normal healthy life to, to old age probably uh right shoulder right arm left arm there you go so i missed the intro what's new there is new body oh, i need to put it in there is that what i've got to do but i gotta get it first uh there's new bodies new spooky events uh there's a bunch of bug fixes because back when we first played this Oh boy, that we have a lot of bugs. Uh, and there were so many events that I had not seen at embalm. all. Time to embalm. Well, we know how this works, huh? All it's right. time for the creepy I've stuff. I've set everything out so you can just go ahead and get started. I'll be monitoring. Okay. Can Everything's I... on your list there if you need it. Yeah, I would like to open this door. Hello? I can't open this. Oh, it's already here. <laughs> it's like, what the fuck? <laughs> <laughs> it's already set out. Can't hold anything else. Oh, okay. Whoopsie daisy. Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay, drop. I can't hold it. Don't. Anything else? Shut up. I'm going to become. The there we go. Thank you. Pick it up. Pick it up. All of this. That's the first thing. Let me get these two. I can't hold anything else. Okay then. It's a large item. Here we go. It's time to do your teeth. Setting the face. I'm gonna be the tutorial for this one. Uh, if at any point. You start feeling a little dizzy, uh, just look away for a few moments. There will probably be a demon on the screen, um, when you look back. Oh boy. There we go. <gasps> Easy peasy. Eyeball now. I, w I love how you have to go in and out for the eyeball. You have to just make sure that you right. know what you're doing. There we go. Advice of the year. I mean, there's demons everywhere. Uh, I just need to combine this stuff now. Yeah, here we go. Put it all in there. I can't, hold anything, I can't else. hold anything else because I'm stupid and I picked this up when I didn't have to. Drop it. Drop it. Drop it. Yes. Thank you. There. Hmm. Sometimes we get chemicals that haven't been stored properly. Why are you can make them pop like that. What the Just fuck? Keep doing the I forget oh, everything. Yeah. <laughs> this shit's terrifying. Okay. Now the piping, right? Or the tubing, I should say. Boom. Yeah! I'm missing something. You're missing something! The artery forte forceps. There you go. Oh, I forgot about that machine being the loudest thing to ever be created. Oh yeah, boy. Why don't I look at you instead, huh? 
staring contest? Do you blink? He doesn't fucking blink. I'm gonna lose. Ah, my eyeballs! <laughs> he doesn't blink. What the fuck? He doesn't breathe, he doesn't blink. Is he even real? He, he doesn't even move. He's just standing still. It's like the game is on pause. Don't look at me like that, sir. Why does he not blink? Um, excuse me. What the fuck? <laughs> he saw it this time? <laughs> what do you mean he saw it this time? Did that happen before? What the fuck? Okay, let's... Why is this floating? Y yes, it, it just happened? What the fuck? I swear... That's the... I've been not paying attention, apparently. I would like to... Oh, no. This is time to do the creepy stuff. I remember this one. Yup, that's my favorite. Weird flex bag, but okay. Yucky bucky. I missed it the first time. Wow. That's the thing. That's why I think this is the perfect, like, YouTube and streamer game. Because so... It's crazy like you see people miss stuff all the there time and it adds so much to your own playthroughs because you know you might be missing something as well you might be the one who is uh who misses a demon that's like floating somewhere on the screen so good i love how raymond is just standing there motionless just looking at me all right we gotta clean this thing right i still know this i don't need i have not looked at my clipboard a single time i mean i guess it's because they also just like lead me how to do it oh it's not very difficult hey sir you want to go want to try it again can i crouch i can't crouch in this game look at that Woo! how does she do it it's a magic lady all right i fixed it i think we're done right are we done we need to apply moisturizer to the face. We gotta do skincare. Don't be like the average man who literally just. Ooh! Tell you what. What? Why don't you go ahead and head out? I'll take over from. He here. moved. It's a uh, freaking zombie. Are you sure? I just got here. Don't worry, you're doing great. I'll get the last of your paperwork sorted today and call you in for your first shift. Okay. Goodbye. You are you gonna talk? Okay. Hello. Um, I'm gonna leave now. Goodbye. Uh yeah, I hate it here. <laughs> the girl. Uh oh. Go ahead, it's fine. I'll give you a call when I get something. You didn't I was already leaving. Don't talk to me, Raymond. Goodbye, Ray Ray. Time to get a new job. I, if you come back you after this happened, really then you're stupid. So some stuff fell over. That's not a big deal. No, I know. It, it wasn't even my fault. But I just keep on this home right after that. I'm just really worried. He was supposed to finalize my stuff today. And he said he would, right? Yeah. So that's a good thing. Yeah. It just didn't feel like he meant it. The one like, song radio. He just said it to get me out of the building. <laughs> uh, wait a sec, I have another call. Is that actually a Hello? thing? Hey, Rebecca. It's Raymond. Oh, hi, Mr. Delver. Uh, look, if I did anything wrong today, just... No, no. Uh, I wanted to apologize. You've done a fantastic job. I'm just not feeling too well. Okay. There are bucks with uh, the, the 11 months. Again. Hoping you could come in and take care of them. Well, uh, yeah. Uh, are you sure? I, I mean, of course. <laughs> Excellent. Why do you do this at li at night, huh? You're doing me a huge favor. Huge. We took care of the rest of your onboarding. We're all set. And your new badges and your personal belongings drawer in the back room. That's great. Pretty nice uh, apartment, thank you. indeed. I I'm on my way right now. I hope you feel better. Thanks again. I'll see you tomorrow. Bye. Alrighty. Bye bye. Holy shit, that was him. He signed me on. He needs me to come in tonight. <gasps> See? I told you it was fine. Congratulations. Thanks. Working I have to in go. a morgue. Like, what a, right what a job. I'll talk to you later. 
Are we gonna get DJ Two Shades to immediately talk to us? Because the radio song should always yeah, almost be keys. at the end, right? Where are your keys? They're right there. Also, I missed this. Oh, yeah, temporary items. I know how that works. Uh, is he gonna talk? There's, there was a reference to John Wolf in here. <laughs> Wolfos. I missed it. The, and I love because I was I watched uh, John Wolf's uh, like playthrough. And he was like, he missed it. So then they were like, you missed it, piece of shit. <laughs> and, and they put some shade to him in the game. And we, there's lots of stuff. Oh yeah, you can all, you can throw stuff around, but that doesn't happen too often. Are you gonna talk to us, Mr. Two Shades? I think I'm just gonna go this time. I know there's, there's some stuff. Wait, do we get this yet? Uh, we can maybe get them yet? Yeah, yeah, I think so, but I don't. Well, I guess we could grab them. Oh, here we go. Talk to me. I'm Mr. Two Shades. Yeah, and, and this is the one song radio station. We're gonna play we, this is the one song radio station because we're gonna play the same song because it's all we have the budget for. I'm DJ Two Shades. <laughs> <laughs> it's so fucking good. I'm gonna leave this here for now because I. If you do that too early, you get the, the true ending way too early in your playthrough. I don't want to do that. So we're going to go do a normal run as if we're noobs first. And then we'll do that uh, next round through. Now we get back to our regularly scheduled programming, which is just listen to the same song. DJ Two Shades. <laughs> Riverfield, here we are. All right. I guess I'll head to the back and get started. <gasps> Hi there. I forgot about you. What the fuck? Um, there's a man in the window? Hi, Rebecca. <sighs> Mr. Delver, I need help. Someone's outside the mortuary. Just try to stay calm. I know you're scared. I'll unlock the door in a Wait, this is, what? this is that it's guy. I sudden, forgot. But listen to me. We have to start right away. I'm sorry. I didn't know until it made itself known this morning that it was here, let alone bound to you. I had no way of knowing the possession had started. What? Look, this isn't funny. Stop. You need to take this seriously. You need to act quickly. This is insane. I'll just leave. I'll, I'll just fucking leave. You can't leave, Rebecca. I, I can't allow that for you or for others. It's far too dangerous. <laughs> what am I supposed to do then? Most bodies I work with at night are fine. So we stay. Are you gonna leave? Okay. We embalm, file the paperwork, everything. Treat oh, he's actually the full on calling me right now. Staying focused will help. I left some things for you on the desk. I'll call again when you get to the embalming room. No, wait. <sighs> Look at that! I didn't even fuck? realize he did that he had the phone. It's insane. I can't open the door. Okay. That's cool. I didn't even so I didn't realize that the just first some time. Hazing for the new girl or something. <laughs> just, just play along and do your job. Yes, I will get the old key, the hall key, and the tape recorder. Thank you very much, my presence. Oh yeah, use the key. Hall key, I'm guessing. The old key is for something. Quitting tomorrow. I mean, who does something like this? Um, are you quitting though? Oh, more phone calls. Listen carefully. I'm, uh, look, I'm sorry, but this literally kidnapped, thing is by the way. Extremely unprofessional. If this is how you treat new hires, I don't think I can work for you. This isn't funny. Rebecca, you don't have to believe me, that but I hope you do before it's too late. You don't have to believe me. The only way to save yourself is to banish the demon before you're too far gone. To do that, you will need to learn the demon's name, bind it to its chosen. I remember hearing this for the first time, and I was like, "What the fuck is going on?" <laughs> This is a lot to take in. I I'm wish being gaslit. I had years to learn what I know. I have Even hours. hours. <sighs> I've recorded a number of cassettes to instruct you in the hope that we need those were smart with a known message will help you stay grounded. I won't be calling again. You can't trust the phones. Anything can be manipulated. Can't trust the phones, huh? Listen to the tapes. Learn the demon's name. Burn the correct body. The most important thing in the room is in that cabinet. Open it up. But the old key. Good luck, Rebecca. I'm sorry this had to happen. 
<laughs> I'm sorry this ha I'm sorry I had to lock you in a mortuary. This is insane. Whatever. Just be the professional one, grab a body and Just burn get all of them and win the game, forehead. Just burn them all. Look at yeah, <laughs> screw all of whatever this is. I'm getting back to work. Yep, I'm taking this. A letting strip. This is gonna re er, help us, right? <laughs> Jesus Christ, that's so oh my this show is not supposed to be on top of me like that. <laughs> That's gonna help us find these kind of symbols, as you can tell. <laughs> okay then. Uh, and then you fill it in, in this, to like remember which one they were. Cause they can actually disappear. The, the demon can make these disappear. And if you haven't already found them before that, you're actually fucked. Now there are all these tapes. I guess I could, I'm gonna pick this up and we could listen to one of the tapes while we um, start the first embalming. The night shift database, a computer program combining all my findings into one Open reference this point. The database contains all the- What are the names? The process of expulsion. Drew Patrick. Was used. And most Ellen Day. All the Timothy, the, it's Timothy names. from I'm an observation dude. Whoever forget what to do, replay these tapes. Oh, you need the yellow pad, the yes. Database. We need to grab the this collection for the of demonic names is the Oh, I can't grab it yet. Piece to the no Tony Pizza. You will need this information. I will. My ID card is in my personal belongings drawer. On the back is the passcode to access it. Crummy old building. Crummy old building! Fuck me in here. Scare the shit out of me. <laughs> oh boy, I'm so ready. There we go. Hi there, sir. I know you could do like this. Yeah, look at that. You can you can speedrun it so hard. So one of these bodies is gonna, if you have never seen this game before, welcome to Mortuary System. One of these bodies is gonna be a demon and it is up to us to figure out which of that bodies, right, or which of the bodies uh, is the demon. And we'll, wait, is this new? Rebecca Raymond asked me to take over restocking the rest of the supplies in the embalming room, but he's so secretive. I feel like I get different instructions every day. Sorry if this is not what you're used to, Zoe. Yes, could you ask him to stop calling me Zoe? No one asked, calls me that? Wait, what's the difference? <laughs> Zoe? 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 I don't even know. And then we get the keys that I can never pick up that always extra keys that you can't pick up. And there's a code on the back here, which he told us about. 000536. 00536. Let me fill whatever. that in. Whatever. 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 Forget it. Can I not fucking talk Whatever. to the computer? <laughs> what do you mean? Why can't I? Forget it. Why can't I talk to the computer? Forget it. Computer locked. I don't understand. Why? Huh? <laughs> Wait. Do I need? What does this say? Raymond, I really ask. Really need a key to the hatch outside. Cleaner is cleaner is low, and you mentioned having some down there before. I know you don't trust anyone to go down there, but having a copy of the key would make things a lot easier for everyone. Zoe. What? What? Whatever. What? What? Do I need to grab this card? I don't. I don't. Just forget it, I guess. Oh, I can't wait to see our first stuff. I'm so excited for all the scary shit that happens. Uh, okay, let's do our simple. Uh, investigation. <laughs> Hello? What the fuck? Nope, nope. New job. I'm getting out of here. Simple investigation failed. Get up, fuck out of here! How long I went to school? New career path. Fuck this. Maybe... No. Maybe... Everything's fine. It's... it's fine. Uh, what? I forgot all no, of this. No, I... I just, you're just, I'm just... Just, I'm getting gaslit by myself! I'm just seeing things. I... Need to get back to work. It's... it's fine. Bye. I'm leaving. Fuck this. I'm not getting gassed up by myself. I'm out of here. <laughs> doot doot. Go. Wait, I can actually do. Wait, you can? No. Oh, 
This is new. You couldn't do this. Kidding me? I can't believe him. Oh, my car actually got sabotaged. Wait, what the fuck? What am I doing? This is ridiculous. I shouldn't be out here. It's my fucking fault. Get back to work. What? That's so cool. That didn't happen last time. That's all new stuff. What the fuck? This is not new. I'm just stupid. I just didn't see it before. Can I get the hell out of here? I, last time I did try to leave, but it never worked. Like, God, the gate's locked. The gate's freaking locked, dude. Uh, I tried to leave last time, but maybe I had to go over the fence. Wait, can we? Can we jump over the fence? Oh, not climbing the fence. I got no way out achievement. Try to leave the mortuary. <laughs> I've got an achievement. Let's go. We got a 100% the game. All right. Well, I guess we're closing the door. I'm stuck here. Fuck. I, I said it before, but I love that this has a little bell. Like, imagine walking into a mortuary and it goes ding a ling a ling. Okay, well, I guess we're continuing. Do we grab this now, or can we still not do that? Oh, we can. Uh, yes, we can check possession now, which we're not possessed at all. Look at that, even though we saw just a bunch of demons like that. Um, I guess it's fine, or whatever. Hello. Why are these doors closed? That door's supposed to be open. Uh, I was checking you out. I was checking if there was... There you are. Oh, I am... I am ready to be utterly terrified. More. There's one on this leg too. The tapes. We'll play a tape. Okay. At every moment, the demon is funneling its energy through you, weakening you until you are unable okay. to resist. Six. Identifying a demonic entity is a delicate balance. The further you are from possession, the more time you have. The closer you are, the more the demon will make itself known, allowing you the information to guess its uh, name there we go. and the body it's bound. Perfect. To. I've found to Man, tell how far along the possession is on your own is to scribble on a piece of paper. Don't think about it. Just scribble. Just Look scribble. carefully. If you notice anything strange, oh, start to take hold. You smiling? There's a notepad and a pencil on the desk in the front room. Checking from time to time can give an idea of how long you might have. You need to file a copy of front. What the fuck? Did someone just knock on the window? I swear I just heard knocking on the window. Uh oh. Come on, guys. Get another sigil. I put this put this away. Uh, it's time to be mom. The echo in that hallway. Why is so much echo in a hallway and not in this out in the open area? Alright, we know how to do this. We're pros. But I uh, am scared of the new events. I'm also scared of the old events. I didn't... <laughs> this is like the game that messed me up real bad when I played it. I remember I, like actually thinking about it. What the fuck? I thought it was smiling for a second. So much after I played the game. It's so spooky. Like the way you do this rhythm every time. It makes like all the nights kind of blend together. And then you just continually like think about all the scary stuff that happened. During the go. nights, it's very freaked out. Oof. All right. Uh, good stuff. Now it's time for the machine, right? Yes, I know how this works. I've done this before. <laughs> Sir? Is this your doing? <laughs> Zoe? <laughs> she prefers to be called Zoe. I don't know the difference. Doors are closing and I don't like it. Stuff's happening. 
Oh boy. And last one. Look at that. Look at this pro. Pro business. Isn't the stuff in here? Yes, they are. She was just. She just needed a Snickers. Uh, don't I? Oh yeah, I got. Wait, don't I put this in? Oh, I need to put in the. I need to put in the thing. Um. The blood of a demon. <laughs> I remember. Let's play this tape as well. To banish a demon to hell. It must to be banish a demon to hell. Body and burned. The three objects in this cabinet are your tools. Pick it up. First, the clay tablet in the center is called a mark. Placing the smaller pieces. I guess. Second, the bottles on the top shelf are a special. To the mark. Uh, somewhere? <laughs> when the mark is placed on the correct Boom. body with the reagent inside, there it is. The B. Become bound to it. Smudge stick. Pay attention to signs that you can do. I can't hear you. The machine's too loud. The sigils of its Setting name, our script. world to begin the evocation. B. You will need to uncover these sigils to use them. Yes. Hold a letting strip up. With three, you can already it. figure it out. I'm pretty sure. If it begins to smolder and burn, something. you're close. When the paper combusts, the sigil has been revealed somewhere in that area. They can be anywhere. So look on walls, under objects, inside furniture, anywhere. I know. The demon will inscribe its sigils over time to try and hide them. So check regularly. Once you uncover the sigils, use the night shift database to decide which demon you're dealing with. And <laughs> use that knowledge to create the mark. The steps are simple. Add the reagent to the embalming mixture. Uncover the sigils. Build the mark and place there it on the body. Then, when you're certain, burn it in the retort. I think we're done with this one, right? Oh no, we need to do more. We need to clean the pump and use more uh, moisturizer. So uh to summarize what the fuck what did someone just say something <laughs> is that you excuse me um to summarize what you just what he just explained uh you have to Basically do the embalming process and then during the embalming you need to put the blood of a demon inside the body uh, You're gonna do that for all of them and then during the mission you're gonna use these lettings Hello Up upstairs neighbors could you just chill out Stop doing the dirty This is not the time you're living above a mortuary. You can't do that all the time Also, we have a mirror or you have a mirror that actually works you can even wash your hands. You can even flush the toilet. Look at that. Did I leave this on? No. Oh. Uh, Rafra, thank you for the nine months. And then during the mission, you have to pay very close attention to which bodies are per, are doing like spooky events. So you look well, ne not necessarily spooky events, although that is also a part of it. But you can look at them if they move around a little bit, or if new marks appear on the bodies. You can learn. Uh, what, um, like which body is the demon? There's also another tri There's also another thing you have to do, which is you have to collect the name of the demon. And in order to do that, you also have a little bonus trick you can do. You can grab this bag. You can collect some, uh, some ash here, and then you can put that on the body like this. Now this is this works the same for everybody, so it's not, it's not the demon that. You, this doesn't just work for the demon. This works for every single body. You grab the, the one match here, and then you light it, and then this happens. And then you know what, like, family of demon this demon belongs to. So then we can go into the computer. Yes, we can actually go into the computer now. Night shift, we need 00536, if I remember correctly. Uh, and then you can go over here. Is this the one? Yes, sigils. So we know it's this one, right? This was the symbol. 
So we know it's going to be one of these demons. And because we already got the this one, this symbol, and the B, we actually know it's this demon. We know it's Kovas. We don't even have to collect the other things. Because with the Ash, we learned it was this type. And then with the two sigils that we have, none of the... That's the only one that has both of those. So we already know that it's got to be B, Droplet, and the Z. B, Droplet, Z. Uh, B... Dead, and this one so this is the mark we put this one on the demon when we know which one the demon is so there you go that's already one of the major components figured out let's continue i don't know if this is the body it doesn't seem like it i need to moisturize your face i remember creepy stuff happening i don't know. I can see it what's your can't hold can't hold anything else and hold anything else oh just because they didn't clean the machine yet clean it What the fuck? I'm getting high. What's going on? Did I not? Did I not? I didn't put it in the machine. But why the fuck did the? <laughs> Hello? You, Charlie? Think you're the five gift subs? What the fuck? Disco party. There we go. Now it's fixed. Melinda, thank you for the 17 months. I got distracted when I uh, when I wanted to do the ash here. That's what happened. Okay, clean it. Clean the machine, and then grab the wipes. I wish you could do the wipes while the machine is going, but that would probably lead to a bunch of soft blocks. All right, let's open the window. Let's say I, I let let's get some cool air in here. Anna, thank you for the six months in advance, and it's Mrs. Miss Hyde. Thank you for the prime. I'm just looking around. I don't want to miss a single event. I know that if I miss something, you guys are probably gonna tell me anyway. All right, here we go. Last step. Last step. <laughs> They made this last a whole lot longer. I remember back when this game first came out, that was like instantly done for some reason. The speedrunners are gonna be upset. You're gonna talk to me? Are you smiling? Kind of looks like you're smiling a little bit. Look where they stick you for the sub. Who we'll turned off the light? It's not, it's, it's, it's a mare? Okay. The man turned it off. Uh, now we grab... Who is it? Who is this? It's Ellen Day. Hello? Anyone out there? Knock, knock, knock. We can check for fingies. You got a door touch? This is creepy. Hello, lady. So there is... I don't know... This is a new body. I think I remember this body from the... From previous... Playthroughs. But there should be a few new bodies... That are... Uh, that we haven't seen before. Which I don't know if they're gonna be male or female bodies. Also, your feet look extremely... Wow. That is different from before. The feet look like they're... All the blood is drained from them. Or they're like brute. Wow. What the fuck? They look so much more messed up now. <laughs> I mean, it makes sense. But still. That is... That's messed up. Okay, how many are there? There. Nothing on the other side. On the... Their feet were wriggling? It's blue knees. Blue knees will find... I forget the song. I should I should know the song. I already clicked that, huh? Oh, there's something on your face. No, stop. You get the song stuck there in your go. head. There we go. Okay. Not the song. Blue knees will find you. I don't want to interact with this. What am I doing? Stupid. Uh, I would like to fill it in the machine. I think that's all. You. There's more stuff here to look at. In case you don't know what you're doing, but we know exactly what we're doing. But yeah, you can learn about how to figure out what the demon is. Identifying the demon is like based on these kind of symbols. You you those start showing up on the body. There's also stuff like 
this. All right. This working? Yeah. This thing is huge. So, uh. The ashes can give guess. the wrong house now? Um, Why? Okay, this interesting. This is David. Raymond, this feels insane, but I think you were right. This has happened a few times now, but let me see if I can get in here. Boop. There it is. Boop. Fuck. <laughs> Moving feet. Fuck. Fuck. Moving feet. Okay, so we actually need to continue figuring out what the demon is. And then tools of expulsion we already did. Okay, interesting. I did not know that the demon could fake you out, which actually is very cool. That's cool. That Otherwise, it could be too easy, but they changed that. All right, here we go. Ellen, 21? What's 9 plus 10? What the fuck, man? No. 21. Feels bad. So we need to grab another one of these one things. Of you already have one of those. Oh, I should have known. Sir, you cannot be here. What the fuck? My, I'm going disco vision. Uh, no, thank you. <laughs> Give me this. I, there, there are new events. I don't think I've seen that before. There are just new events constantly. Because there's like, I don't know, like hun like a like hundred events or more. You're not going to see all of them, even if you play the game many, many times. Hey, Luna, welcome to the stream. You made the pilgrimage from YouTube uh, to Twitch. Welcome to, welcome to the family, son. The Twitch family. Um, okay, I'm going to grab all the stuff. Because it's time to do the dirty. I like that you can carry it all at once, and it's not just like a grabby game constantly. Grabbing what you need specifically. Okay, I just gotta do this stuff. Here you go. The way the head like shakes as you spike it. Desi, thank you for the sub. There we go. Rebecca. Uh, All this. We're gonna figure out the whole, I'm gonna we can now fully experience the story from start to finish and like fully Alan analyze the true ending as well You stupid bitch Amazing she thank you for the Hate 20 gift subs He's dead because of you. This is our mom. You should be the one here Lightless Worthless <laughs> Give it to me. Give it to me. What what give to you? Stop it. Check my sanity after that. Uh-oh. <laughs> a little bit more cursed. Little more cursed one step at a time. Uh I would like to continue this ritual as if nothing ever happened. Right. Demon wants us. Now we should we know better than to tunnel vision. Because I was I mean, I wasn't the best at the game when I first started playing. I sucked like a lot of ass. But to be fair, it's a difficult game when you start out because you don't know what you're looking for, right? You don't know what is important information and what is uh, just like red herrings a demon tries to throw at you to make you uh, make mistakes. So now we're be pros. We're gonna we're gonna get it. We're gonna not get it wrong a single time. However, we do need to get it wrong one time because we need to get the true ending, right? Or not the true ending, but we need to get all the endings, and one of the endings requires you to fail. So yeah, we gotta do it all, all from the very beginning. Boom. Speed run. We're not doing a speed run. We're we're playing the video. I always check for the sigil during. Okay, what? What? It's in the bathroom. Ah, the Q. Let's see if that is, uh, that lines up. No, that does not line up. So the sigil is wrong. What the fuck? Wait, that's demon lied. That lied about 
the type of the ghost. That's interesting. Very sneaky. So you do... Why is even the point of the ash then? Is it just to know... Maybe it lies... It's more likely to lie if you do it on the demon body because it's more powerful. It does look like you're smiling. I, I gotta give it to you. Yeah, indeed. Um, okay, I need to do this I'm shit. Missing I'm missing something. something. I'm missing something indeed. Um, this. Oof. Now we do this. If not fa- Not failing a single time. This is a speed run. I mean, kind of. You have to do it- Oh, you have to do it on the demon body and then it gives the right answer? But then you could use it to figure out what the demon is. That would be kind of cheating. So we know that one is not the- Oh, okay. So we know it's not the demon. Wait, that's actually huge intel? You can just rule out one of the bodies with using that? Wait. What the? I s was moving my screen. I don't. S there was something that showed up. Amazing she! Thank you for the 20 more gift subs. Thank you. What the hell was that? What just happened out here? What? What? Thank you. That is really cool. I wonder if they changed that. I feel like they must have changed that. Anyway, yeah, they definitely changed that. Uh, we need to do the cleaner. That way, thank you for the prime. Timpani, thank you for the prime. Cool. Oh, I would like to pick it up. Did not know about it. Finding the sigil. Yeah, if you put it on the right body and you get the right answer, you just know that you got the right one and otherwise you know you get you can just rule out one of the bodies so now we only have to look out at two of the bodies because we didn't get these we got the q instead right so the q and then the z might be wrong too we just have to we have to see during the last embalming so grab the moisturizer but you can do the ashes how many times you can only do it once because you only have one lighter so yeah i mean otherwise it would just be che cheesy as heck so all right fine. Um, yes, I don't need to look. Um, did you just move? You're gonna move your feet? Nothing has happened with you, huh? You're not very creepy, I gotta say. Maybe it's the last body. Here we go. She moved. I did everything, right? Yes, return the body. Check her for demonic scratches. We'll do that in a sec, because it... We'll give her a little bit of time in the oven. To see if any demonic scratches will show up. And now our final guest is Timothy Donovan. I remember you. You look like Tony Pizza. Oh, then you mean freezer? Same thing. I swear. His eyes are terrifying. <laughs> ah! What the fuck? How does that work? <laughs> I mean, it's a ghost, I guess. <laughs> what a <the> fuck. <laughs> My guy, you can't just do that. It's a shade. You walk through it. Okay. Um, I will start now. You got a huge... I need to do the scratches first. Huge scratch. Um, is it a demon scratch? No, I guess it's just a normal scratch. Whispering. I am concerned by my own sa for my own safety. That scared me so bad. That was really unexpected. And is that not it? Oh, you got something on your feet. There we go. There we go, indeed. Notepad scribble. Notepad scribble. Can we already make out what that's gonna be? I feel like we should be able to. We also, we just can, we can get the last name here, right? Ooh. This whole system makes no sense. I feel like left shoulder, right shoulder, left arm, right arm, and then right, left leg, right leg here. It's just weird. My favorite event ever, I can't forget this one. My favorite event ever was when I was sitting at the computer and then the demon showed up and walked towards the computer. And then he like stands there. It's terrifying. That's like my favorite event. I hope we see that again.
What the fuck, man? Ah! Oh, you piece of shit. I did not expect that would happen. <laughs> Holy fuck. That got me good, man. <laughs> Jesus. That came out of nowhere. Was not ready for that. Okay, well, um, let's just do the thing, huh? Did I not do the thing? Oh, I need to put it in first. Did you get into the darkness? Because I wanted to fix the darkness. I wanted to turn on the light. You streamed like a little girl. Like, are you the demon? You're pretty sussy to me. The fact that we just got grabbed by someone makes me believe you might be a certified freak seven days a week. There we go. Did this game get an update? Yeah, there are, uh, they added a ton of new creepy events. Right. As far as I know. Which, I don't think I've seen that one, for example. And I don't think I saw this one, the walking here. I don't think I saw the one where it crouched like there. So yeah, we're just constantly getting new stuff. Anyway, we gotta uh, do the machine now. That was an original one. I mean, they, we might be seeing stuff that we didn't. Because the thing with this game is that it's a different play playthrough. Every playthrough gives you something completely different, right? So there's going to be... There's like so much replayability here. You could literally just play it over and over and over again. And you'll still see new things. There you go. That's why it's so cool. Rip out his teeth. What are you evil? Oops. No idea why I'm watching. Ah! What the fuck, man? I, I was just reading a chat message. I have no idea why I'm watching this before sleeping. I have also no idea why you're watching this before sleeping. What the fuck? Okay, you gotta give me the final sigil. Did you try to hide it yet? Nope. We missed that. We need it. Because we we got the wrong uh, demon type. We actually need to get the right sigils. The events are so good. Oops. All right, let's finish this guy. Uh, I already got that. Get ready. You ordered some burgers to go with the stream. <laughs> Petty King, thank you for the 11 months. That's almost a year. And the Cessors, thank you for the 100 bitties. And Nick Steve with the 100 bitties as well. Thank you, guys. Needle work. Burgear. Burgear. After more complex events, you can hear some whispers. That's when the sigils appear. Wait, really? Oh, there there's so much depth to this game that I did not know about. <laughs> okay, now we gotta clean the machine, right? Yes. His teeth are good. Yeah, you got some solid teeth. We got solid teeth. You brush your teeth. That's some this like runny soap. I swear I just heard breathing, breathing during that. Is it you? Are you the demon? We still have no idea. None of the bodies have moved. Let's look at your feet. Look at the feet. Are the feet gonna do a little, little, a little juke? Hmm. Hmm. Feet pick. Rebecca. Hi. Sir. Rebecca. Rebecca. And shut. That looks awesome. Come up. Ah! What the fuck? Thank you. Does this mean there's a new sigil to find? What? Oh no, wait. Uh oh. Uh oh. Possess time. Possession time. 
Are you are you having a good time? Uh, we gotta moisturize your face. He is so smug. All right. Why are you so smug? Let's check. Do you got any marks on you? Any any demon marks in the chat? No. Doesn't look like it on your back, maybe. Oh my god. Yes. <laughs> Holy fuck. Jesus. Just a small mark. <laughs> is it you then? We gotta look at the feet. Are they gonna move? We gotta look. Play switch. Uh, it might be this one. Just look. Are you gonna move? We got half the people to look at the. Half the people. Oh. Oh, they fixed this bug. No, there used to be a bug where you could open your <laughs> You could open your clipboard while crouching and then it would permanently keep you crouched I was trying to use that bug, but no no bug I do not see any Movement which the demon can mark the wrong body for you. I mean, we have a 50-50 no matter what we do. And we need to lose anyway, right? Um, so it's not like... It, it, it's okay if we fill. I just gotta get this body back in now. Let's swap it out and look at the other body. See if there's a mark on that one too. Because we are getting possessed. Here, like any moment. I'm scared. Burn the ashes. We already did that. We already did that. And we, we got it. We did it on the wrong body because it was the wrong sigil, which I did not even know. I think they changed that. I don't think that used to be a mechanic. I feel like they changed that. Let's see. Do you got anything on you? And dream job is actually forensic pathology. I couldn't really understand people that would be like, my dream job is to be a mortuary person. That's like... That's just crazy. I don't know. Is that fire? You are you doing something? There's nothing on your face. If you did not ha get a mark, I know we know it's the other guy, right? Anything on your back? No. It's gotta be the other guy, right? Just this lady does not have a mark. Unless you fooled us all. Let's also look if we can find the final sigil. Our feet? I don't think there was a mark. It's gotta be the other guy. The fact that there's a huge burn mark on your... How close are we? We're getting very close. There's no final sigil? What the fuck? Why not? Is this... Is this bugged? Is there supposed to be no final sigil sometime? Because we, I, we know how we can do this, right? But still. I, ooh. Did, I, did I miss something? Did I, did I miss something? Anyone see anything? I did not see anything. Try out outside? Is outside a thing? I don't think that. It doesn't really matter. We already know what it, what it is. Let's just let's just figure it out. Because what we got to do is go over to here, and then which one do we have? Which sigil? It's this one. I'm guessing this one. Immolation, which means it is this one. Balmet, right? Uh, yes, it's Balmet because we got the Q, we got the B, we got the Twirly Twirl. So we need the pie at the bottom. We need Twirl, B, Q, pie. Twirl. Twirl, B, Q, pie. That should be the mark. We're gonna put it on the other body, and then I think we're gonna burn our first one. We got a bunch of night shifts ahead of us, so let's get this one out of the way. Before we die to possession. Because that would be a shame. We already got our story event this run too. Because I think you get a story event every run. Alright. It's you, my friend. You're evil. It's gonna say you're wrong, you know, when I do this. I, I have a feeling you're gonna be talking to me. Because you're a little sassy demon, aren't you? I'm just, I'm just so on edge by anything that could happen at any point. So I don't know if you have to put it in the specific order. I'm guessing you... What the fuck? 
sir. Sir, <laughs> get off of there. Get off the roof. <gasps> Holy shit. Yeah, if this is not the right demon, I don't know what the hell. You're wrong, you know. I don't think I am, you little shit. I don't think I am. You're trying to bait me. You're wrong, you know. He's baiting me. Or it might be reverse psychology. Or... Or the, or the opposite of reverse psycho. Okay, definitely you. All right, I, I am, I have decided. Uh, bye bye. <laughs> bye bye. This won't fix anything, Rebecca. I'm clicking the button. Here it goes. That should be it. It's De Deanna's, thank you for the three months, Teddy Bear, thank you for the six months, and Mindpuff, thank you for the 12 months, and Ranty with the prime as well, and Montrose with the six months. It's closing through the metal. Can I bug it out again somehow? How did I do that? Fix that bug? I think they fixed it. Remember when I did that? <laughs> I like started drifting on the floor. And bye. No drifting. That was awesome when I did that. That was the best bug there. It was. It Morning. did. Oh, here we go. Please. It's nice not to be the one down there for a change. Is it, did we do it? Raymond. I suppose a first name basis uh -oh. is in order. D did I make it? Is it over? For now. Uh -oh. It's never really. Might be over. wrong. The body was wrong, but there was a way. giant it's mark a on the back. Way. Are you kidding me? I'm so glad I'm here. Uh oh. Yeah, we're. I know big. it's disorder. It's very wrong. You'll get used to it. How the fuck was it wrong? There was a giant burn home. mark on your Get's back, my guy. Every night can be different. Uh oh. I think I'm fine. Uh oh. Are you mm. sure? Mm. 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 Oh, I've just been waiting. <laughs> it was so, just a mole. <laughs> so long. I think this is actually. Oh, God. You? Oh, no. You chose the wrong body. Rebecca. I got baited. He was actually <laughs> doubling down on that. What? What? Oh my god, I feel so baited. Like the shaking. Dude, there was a giant flash mark on your back. Oh, man. Blink now, you bitch. <laughs> I love the throw. <laughs> well, uh, it was a 50-50, and one of the bodies had a giant mark. And we got it wrong anyway! Fuck you! Okay, well, that's the first ending. That's the Diane. That's the Vecna ending. <laughs> Chrissy, wake up! I don't like this. <laughs> hey, Skip, get me back in! You lied to me! You didn't lie to me. You spoke the truth, actually. Why? I what? Imagine the face of this demon. If it said, you're wrong, you know, and I went like, okay. <laughs> and then I swapped the bodies and it was like, what the? Wait, wait, what the fuck? <laughs> you're not supposed to actually listen to me. All right. We're not grabbing these yet because we need to get it correct before we try that. So let's do it. DJ Two Shades. I'm not talking to DJ Two Shades anymore. <laughs> He's no longer my best friend. Random Swedish guy. Thank you for the five percent. Thank you. Oh, another night at the mortuary. What could possibly go wrong, huh? One of the endings achieved. Probably the easiest ending to achieve, though. So we gotta pay. We gotta up our game here. Do I still have? To, I don't have to grab this, right? Oh, I can, I have to grab the tape recorder every time, so you don't have to have that on you. The gamer button. Thank you for the gift sub. I like that because the tape recorder. It's actually kind of like a waste of inventory space. Uh, new code every morning, right? So we need to check it. What's the code this time? You guys got to remember this. 82945. 82945. I mean, that's fine. I can just fill it in. 82945. Boom. All right, because we probably need that. I don't know everything. Captain Crisco, thank you for the up. And the Vex. 
Buff deck, sorry. Thank you for the 100 bitties. What names do we got this time? We got Annette Henry, Valentin Foyer, and Grand Carvalho. What a name. It's Grand or Swedish guy. Thank you for five more gift subs. All right, get our first body in here. What if, if you complete all the endings and just continue the night? You can just continue forever. You'll just get the same endings, I think. You get like the, oh, you did so good endings. I'm pretty sure. Well, we can see, maybe. Oh boy. We've got a giant mark already. So we need to not be baited by the marks, I guess. I swear that, I mean, I guess we should have looked for the movement, but still, that's some bullshit. We looked at the movement for a while too, right? Didn't we? That seems so bullshit. I was like fully invested in that. All right, there. Cool. The lady moved her feet several times. Yeah, clip it. Clips or didn't happen. I don't believe you. There we go. This is like when people say, I knew it was dots from the very beginning of the match. Like, how how did you know, huh? You you just you just played yourself. You lied to you lied to my damn face. You're lying to my face. Boom. Clip or dip. Clip it and ship it. Okay, we gotta fill that in. Thank you guys so much for all the subs, by the way. It's crazy. Uh, all right. Annette, 26. Was that the body? Wait, we should... This body might be sus. Because that was weird. Why is there a... Why is there a... Uh, what the fuck do you call it? Magnifying glass. Tiny as he. Thank you for the gift shop. Uh, left arm, right arm, right leg. Definitely saw dots. 100%. Did you just breathe? You gotta look at the feet already. It's so subtle though. Like, I've missed it. Looking at the body, I've still missed the feet move. Um, plenty of times. Dancy, thank you for the 100 bitties. And Tanny, thank you for the 200 bitties. Oh, you dog. Thank you for converting your sub as well. Thank you, guys. Alright, we're set up to go. Um, um. How many bodies are we gonna embalm today? I think we can do this pretty fast. And we're gonna get the true ending. Everything. We also gotta go to the basement. Random Swedish guy, thank you for the five more gift subs. Like KJ go. with the 10 freaking gift subs. Thank you. Thank you. What the heck, right. man? Our lady, thank you for the three months. You guys. Okay. Oh, I'm so ready. Show me the spooky stuff. Now... Okay! Huge intel! She just did a breathy. Wait. She just did a breathy. And that's the second time I think that happened. You know what? I'm going sicko mode. I'm going full on tunnel vision on this first demon here. And I'm going... Frickin... Can I, can I figure this out? I need a, I need a strip. I'm gonna grab the ashes. Uh, whoops, I got the wrong thing. This. And we're gonna figure, we're gonna see if this is the demon. This only works on the demon, are you sure? I don't think dead people are supposed to breathe. I don't think so either. Here we go. Boom. So if that's the correct sigil, we might have found our demon. She, I think she's just goofy. She's just a little... Just a little silly. What did I not throw in? I didn't throw in the methanol, which is over here. And the glutalutalu. Yes. Random Swedish guy. Thank you for all the gift jobs. Thank you. And we also need this one. As well as obviously the blood. Thank you guys. I am. I have mastered the art of mortuarying. Mortuarying? Uh oh, I can't, I, I can't, I can't, I'm gonna get age restricted. <laughs> I can't look. <laughs> well, we can look, but then I'm sorry, YouTube, but you can't see this. You can't see this. I'm gonna try not to age, get age restricted challenge. <laughs> this is the one that gets you age restricted. I'm sorry, YouTube. 
You're just gonna be looking at a bl blur screen for now. Goodbye. Chip Bean, thank you for the 10 <laughs> gift subs. Holy shit! Goodbye. And it's gone. You can probably find that one on YouTube somewhere. I mean, you can find it in my first playthrough, which then got age restricted. <laughs> so yeah, I, I'm not gonna take that risk again. Anyway, turn on the machine. Because I got it twice in that one. It, I, even if it, I, I mean, it would be sad because like this game has spawned a whole fucking discussion about age restrictions. Oh. That has been going on for so long. And all the horror YouTubers like chimed in on it because obviously we've been like, we've been noticing this for a very long time. The L big l to youtube right there that it's been like super fucked up like you'll just be i'll just upload uh, like random phasmo videos will constantly just get age restricted for no reason because it's the same game every time like if you've ever seen phasmo that is the most most like pg 13 game you can possibly imagine like there's nothing in that game that should make it 18 plus only it just doesn't make sense where is it oh there it is B, L, and B? Except naked guy. Okay. Uh, B and L. L, B. But yeah, I, I don't... It's been happening to just random games. Like, when I upload Autopsy Simulator, it got age-restricted immediately as well. There's just certain games that YouTube... I don't know. Certain things that YouTube just really doesn't like. And the thing is, which I think... Uh, john wolf had a really good video on the topic uh the problem with it is that unlike the the copyright system with the copyright system you get like a notification where uh oh god we're slowly turning insane you get like a little notification where in the video your copyrighted material is so you can literally just cut it out you can even cut it out like in the video player itself Jepsepticeye also had some good videos on this topic. I mean, I've, there was just everyone has said everything there is on the topic, so I didn't feel like I had to make my own. Because there's like everyone and their mom has made a video on uh, on age restriction. I think Je Jack said it right because Corey made a video on it, which like blew the hell up and started everyone talking about it. Which Corey uh, posted a, a really like. I think Jack said it right, because you don't want to take away from Corey's issue, but it's an issue that, like, that, that, like, happens to, that is happening currently across all of YouTube to all, especially horror creators. What the fuck? FBI, open up. It's just YouTube is cracking down so much on age restrictions for some reason now. And age restrictions, like, they're so fucked up. They just ruin the whole video. They, like, completely destroy the 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 recommendation of a video so if you get age restricted you might as well just like remove the video because it's just it's just over like it's done and the worst part of age restriction is that it usually happens after like an hour of the video being up so you'll literally like you'll, you'll be like too far in to, to delete the video and like re-upload it re-edit it it's just like i don't know why they do it that way like if they just apply if they told you before you uploaded it that would be nice but it's always after you upload it. it's so annoying and then yet there's like all those bots in the comments that go like that put just full-on like full-on prawn links in the comments like with just like actual hyperlinks and youtube's like no that's fine all right it's so it's so messed up i don't understand okay this is probably the body Get out of here. Excuse me. Or like the bots with usernames that are like, add me on Telegram. <laughs> the fact that, the fact that people fall for those though is like actually insane to me. Like, Hot, like excuse me like someone's username is like and they'll, they'll literally be like 
the, the, the comments will be like up finger up finger up finger like pointing up finger and then the username will be add me on telegram and then like a phone number in like ascii symbols like how naive do you have to be to add the actually message someone <laughs> to actually message that email or a phone number like what the fuck dude like that's so insane to me like that's kind of you kind of just gotta learn the hard way sometimes i guess i mean <laughs> What the fuck? Did I not? Is there something on your face? There's nothing on your face. Wait. Oh, on your leg. There we go. Naive or desperate? I mean, no, because it doesn't. I mean, I don't know, man. It's just stupid. Valentin! Right shoulder, right arm, left arm. Oh, I already got that one. And right leg. What? There we go. Someone was talking outside the window. Yeah, especially like the heat bots. Like, how have they not? So, do we turn on the light now, or do we just fucking bounce out of here and just like jump out the window? <laughs> uh oh, are we gonna get slapped again? That's the thing, you never know. You can never rely on stuff happening. That's why it keeps you on edge. Because sometimes you get smacked, other times nothing happens. <laughs> Ma'am, you can't do that. Gotta calm down, sit back down. All right, um, we grab everything. Yeah, it's so spooky, I love this game. It's the fact that it can still scare you after- How long have I played this game? I played it for... 10 hours total and it still is, is so scary it's that's like a sign of a good game boom you played for 20. i mean there's like an achievement or something when a game is this good i really want to get all achievements so i pro i might just play it all right what the fuck I might just, um, like, I might just do the all achievements off stream. Okay, we need to get the, the machine going now. There's just so much replayability here. It's awesome. And it looks so good, too. Like, it's a very good looking game. Check sanity. There's a the circle. I feel that girl's the demon. I'm pretty sure the girl's the demon. Now, there isn't a cheat. Holy shit. There's an achievement for burning a body before having... We could just burn the, the lady. But, because there's an achievement for burning early without embalming all of them. Uh, and the lady literally laughed at us, right? And we burned the thing on there so we could figure out if... Wait, so let's see. Is there another one? Let's turn on this machine, though, because it's going to take a while. And then we can look for the sigil. Look for the sigil while the machine is being loud as hell. I lit it, looked up from the screen and I'm here. What the fuck? <laughs> Hello? Uh oh. Anything? Yo, thought you'd be hiding in Billy's place. Your dad needs to pull a fucking booster. We're heading down to the beach in just a sec. Grab your kid and get down here. Party's gonna start without you. Um, uh. Grab my kit, my my heroin <laughs> kit. Why does it look like that? <laughs> oh, demon in the corner that I don't remember seeing before. Hi there. I love how I said when I played the second part of this game in my first playthrough, I called this guy my boyfriend, but it's actually your dad. <laughs> you did this to me. <laughs> it's all your fault. Oh, Jesus! <laughs> so that, who is that lady? Is that just a demon? Is that just the embodiment of the demon? Because that is not the, her mom, right? That's not your mom. 
Well, I guess I took Whirly! Figure it out now. Whirly! And with that, we should know if it's the correct demon. Um, which, what sigil, sigil did it have? Wasn't it this one again? I think it was that one again, right? So it's Q, Whirly. Or, wait, no, it's Twirly, B, and L, right? It's Kovas? I think so. So it is actually correct. And we could check this, the sanity mark as well. The sanity mark is turning into a different thing, isn't it? Uh-oh. Uh-oh. That might not be the lady then, huh? It might not... Rebecca doesn't have a mom, does she? Um, I hate to tell you, but everyone actually has a mom. Someone should tell you this. Uh, what else do I gotta do? I gotta do this. That's, that's not how life works. <laughs> yeah, but she's not mentioned. Isn't she? Isn't that the first lady? Who's the first lady? Is that first lady just a random friend? The, f the lady in the first story. Grandma? Why did she look so young? That's... No! The grandma is... No! The grandma is the lady that we see in the first freaking intro cutscene. And I was... I was talking about the lady that we saw in the first story cutscene during the first, uh, like, mortuary nights. Those were the- those- that was her mom, I'm pretty sure, but I'm not- Oh, what the fuck? Okay, I gotta clean the machine, right? Yes. Yeah, so that was the mom. It is the mom, I'm pretty sure. Unless we're- Okay, so I don't know, because it literally just happened, so I don't know why people already forgot about it. <laughs> I mean, the attention span nowadays, the TikTok and everything, it's just not what it used to be. I am right. Okay. These are the symbols we got. So it could be the Kovas. Wait, actually, it probably is Kovas. So it might be correct then. I think so. So it's um, L, Twirly, and B. L, Twirly, and B. So this L and then the B. We need to check if that's actually the correct one. Okay. You are done. Let's moisturize your face. Moisturize that nose. All right. She is mega cursed. You guys are out here telling me it's not Annette, huh? It's gotta be this lady. She is constantly haunted. Let's check again if she got a sigil too. If she got if she got a mark now after moving, right? Moving, I feel, is extremely significant. Let's have some fun. This beat is sick. I want to take a ride on your. To that. Mac McDaddy, thank you for the eight months. There you go. Right on your what? On your on your <laughs> can't say it. I'm gonna get I'm gonna get there's not there's a fight going on with with YouTube and the age restrictions, and I have to be I have to be our five star general. I can't I can't succumb to this. Okay, there's no signs though. Doesn't look like there's any marks on you. Maybe we do have to pay attention. Cause I feel like this is the correct thing, right? Let's see. Do we have... I, I want to try and get the achievement of burning her or burning the bodies before getting the... Or before embalming all of them. The belly. Uh, the belly has a sigil because I did that. That's my doing. You're gonna have a ride on your smudge stick. <laughs> Okay, we'll just embalm all of them. Whatever. Whatever. Or is it like 100%? Is it 
if you get the sigil correct with the burning, is it 100% the demon? Because then this is the demon, right? Is there even another combo? It's 100%. We kind of need to get a little more possessed so we know if this is the right symbol, right? Let's see. Let's look which other has L, L twirly B. It's 99 point. Let's see. Is there any? L. I don't. Maybe it doesn't exist. Maybe there's really only one option. Let's see. Does this one doesn't have it? Does this one have it? L twirly. I don't think it has. Wait, no. So that's the only option. The only option is Kovos, which means it's correct, which means this must be the demon, which means I'm burning you now to get an achievement. And we're getting the better ending. If this is not correct, I'm going to become the Joker. And I've been lied to, but at least we'll learn, right? You don't even want to say anything, huh? Are you sure this is the right one? Okay, never mind. You do want to talk, huh? Yes, I am. Hello? Hello? Why are you still doing that? I'm going to kill you, Rebecca. Okay. Yep, I, this lady sucks. <laughs> Goodbye. Time to burn in hell. Wrong number. Let's hope this is right. It's gotta be right. If this is wrong, I'll be so salty. But hey, you live and you learn. This will tell. This will tell us about the. What is this? It's so busted. Anyway, go. It goes. Friends, are you gonna be laughing at me? Oh. Yes, I got. I got spoiled. <laughs> I got spoiled! The achievement spoiled that I got it correctly. <laughs> Let's go! <laughs> achievement get. <laughs> Let's go. Spoiled. It said... What did it say? Beat the game without embalming all the bodies. It's called I know you. I know you. I do. Hey, La Blanca. Thank you for the hundred biddies. Hey, hey. There you are. Good. Should be actually Is good. Is it over? It's never over. But you survived. Let's go. What do you mean? Can I leave? I want to go home. You can leave. Nice. But once an entity finds you. All the houses of hell will do anything to get back to you. I'm sorry, but it doesn't end here. From now on, there is always a chance this will happen again, no matter where you are. I don't want this. I just want to leave. What do I do? I'm sorry, but there's no going back. I've spent years learning everything I can to keep these entities at bay. It's the only thing we can do. So what? You're waging some selfless, holy war. We still need to learn about it's him. It's not a war. It's survival, and I'd hardly. So call I gotta it go into the basement. But we can't do that We're yet. Caught at the front line of something larger, but I don't do this for some greater good. We either face it or fall to it. I wish I could claim to be someone better, suffering hell to save us all. But I simply want to live another day, just like everyone else. When I first experienced this, I had to make a choice. I could Crush run herbs. and spend the rest of my days in fear, or I could learn to face it and keep some semblance <laughs> of a normal life. Normal. Right. It's not a life I would want for anyone, but choosing between a life of fear or control. <sighs> you're the first person I've met to face this hell and survive. So you just kill so everyone you work with, huh? Kind of job. Work the night shift. Learn what I know. Give yourself a chance at a life beyond fear. 
Ray murder. I don't know what you experienced, but I know it uses the worst parts of you against yourself. The more you experience, the more you'll confront the darkest parts of your life. Yeah, I really love that but about through, the story of this game. You'll become unbreakable. I'm offering the tools to take control. The choice is yours. I hope you come back. Let's go. Nice try. You just want me to do it instead of you, huh? There you go. Ending number one on the second shift. That's pretty good. And we only embalmed two bodies, which was uh, an achievement. I have a lot of the achievements. I got 18 out of 21. What the fuck? And now, oh, the other achievements are really hard to get. Maybe I can get one more. But there you go. Now, continuing. And I think, no, we, I think we have to do it one more time properly before we go for secret endings. Uh, but now the endings will start to really flow because a lot will become clear through the story events. Like, every time you play, you get more story events. I'm gonna turn this off. Fuck off, Mr. DJ. Uh, also need make this. So we're not gonna take this yet. If you want to get the true ending, if you've already played a ton, you need to get these. But I don't want to clog up my inventory and I don't want those yet. I don't want to get them. Because we're not gonna... I... Yeah, I don't want to get the true ending too early. I don't even know if you can do that. I'm just gonna, not gonna not gonna attempt it because I don't want to. I don't want to sequence break this. I want to go through the story as it's intended, and then because uh, now I actually understand where it's going, which allows you to really properly understand the way to get there, right? So you can kind of analyze the story as you go because you're seeing them with the context of how it's gonna end. Which I don't want to spoil how it's going to end, but we're going to explain so what happens whenever things. stuff happens. Which so far, we've seen her mom get overdosed, I think. What names do we got? We got Dame Butter. <laughs> That's, uh, I think, a friend of the developer, a friend streamer of the developer. Uh, we got Frederick Vincent and Jade Swartz. That's not a very normal name, huh? dad oh and no but we don't know about the dad yet we don't know the fate of the dad yet we're not gonna so that's the thing i'm gonna talk about it as it happens i don't want to spoil it before we see it and it's also gonna make it so confusing if we talk about that stuff before we see it tony pizza can i grab this please that was a good one though i actually really like that you can use if you have an idea who it is you just gotta use the ashes to like confirm it or not if that's a hundred percent I mean, that's what I assumed it was initially, and then I figured out that it wasn't. And then they ch apparently changed this feature, because this did not... Like, the ash... Wait, they changed the position of the item. What the fuck? What is this? Why? Why would you do this to me? Why would you do this to me? You evil bitch. You changed the position? <laughs> Fuck you. Three, two, seven, seven. That's so evil. Oh, and there's the the large old game. Not gonna pick that up yet because we can't use it yet. Zoe, Zoe, you fiend. Ah! Oh man, Jesus Christ, Zoe, you're a maniac. Why did you do this to me? How could you? You put it everywhere. Now, this is new. They didn't just do this. Come on. Okay, I'm gonna have to look around. Do I have everything I need? I got the, I need eye caps. I don't have the thing yet that I need to put it in. Is that over here now? Why did you do this? Someone, someone is trying to kill me by being annoying. There we go. That's what we needed. All right. Well, first we gotta get all the marks. There are five endings. And then I actually do wonder what happens if you continue after you got all the endings. I'm guessing you're gonna get all of the endings again. Or like all of them. Because you can't continue. Pony pizza. There's a thing on your face. Lisa wants to kill me. Wait, that's not done yet. There we go. There we go indeed. Is it gonna be different position of the... <laughs> Are they gonna put the items in a different position every night? Or it's just like randomly generated? This is some, this is a speedrun hater. <laughs> They're just trying to make the speedrun more difficult. Rude. 
We're not even possessed yet. Look at that. Okay, I can't do that yet. I'm gonna grab one of these while we're at it. And get an immediate explosion. Oh. It's a Revia. I think you put the stove. They changed the yeah, they changed the position of where all the items are. Also, can I take this? Is this even faster? What if I take this while I'm here? And then I put it in. I can't use that here. You can use that here. I can't I can't use that here. You I, I can't I'm use that. I'm going to Okay, I can't preemptively make a cleaner base, huh? That doesn't you can't do that? Are you kidding me? You can't use that here. You're you can. You literally can though. You're just lying. I'm missing to me. something. You're missing something. Uh the the Where is this? <laughs> Where is this? Oh, is it this? I already, I already have one of those. Oh, no. Um, it's the cables, right? The, the, the wire? This. Yes. Can't use that here. I actually kind of low-key hope it's going to be in a different spot every time now. Oof. There we go. Draconia, thank you for the... And slot. All right. Knock, knock, knock. Who's there? Slabak, thank you for the sub as well. Um, okay, then. Where's the... Where are the bags? Why would you do this? Why would you do this? Why do you do this to me? I cannot... Wait. Am I... Hello? Why can't I interact with you? Did I not do it? Oh, I gotta do the pump first. I'm stupid. I'm stupid. <laughs> Every night it changes. Oh my god. <laughs> That's so troll. I love it. Just to really fuck you. Fuck, fuck you. Fuck with you. <laughs> Forgot a word there. Changed the meaning of the sentence a little bit. <laughs> Alright, let's get the... Let's get the, tu the tubing is also in a different spot. This is even marked on the... It literally says tubing on the thing. Uh... What is wrong with you, Zoe? You piece of shit. I hate you. <laughs> Where's the tubing? Oh, there it is. This the devil's work. <laughs> Did I get the... I can't put it in. I fucking... The tubing. I'm stupid. I didn't put in the blood of a demon. I didn't put in the dark... The, the blood of the dark soul. God damn it. Mystic, thank you for the 13 months. There we go. That's not what I need. You've got what I need. It is PVC tubing. Boom. The dev or devil? <laughs> It's the H, sideways H. Sideways H. That one. More. I mean, if we get an immediate, like, oh. That don't matter what we got. Like, we can try the speed run again. We don't have to burn all the bodies. Because that was really obvious last one. Because not only did we get the movement, but then we... The fuck. We got the movement, but we also got the, um, the sigil. The sigil is going to help us out so much. Like, if that actually confirms the... Why did you let me go? <gasps> this is all your fault. <laughs> Don't we got it. <laughs> I regret every second with you. <laughs> okay then, Mr. Man, but that is why every second with you That is why I thought it was a boyfriend and not a dad because it's a little weird to say that about a child <laughs> I don't know Anyway Because there's not really a choice there but <laughs> Think he's possessed? I don't think that one necessarily means this is the demon. 
I think that one might just be the story because that was a story event right there So that is the that is the dad right there, and I think this is her darkest fear so that This there is God. not actually the dad's demon talking It is the demon talking in the way that she expects her dad to be talking. That is a very important part of the story um, Okay, I did that for you. I got to clean the thing now now I can do it now she's gonna be like, oh yeah, perfect. It's time. Time to do the clean thing. The demon has a dad. We have a dad! I mean, the demon, I don't know if the demon's based on a human, it might have a dad. Moisturize you. You have not moved at all, right? So this way we can actually, this is so good, because we can see which one gets a mark and then which one gets a mark, we'll put the ashes on that one to just confirm if that's the correct uh, demon or not. Whee. All right. Bada bing, bada boom. Out you go. Do you have a mom or dad unless you were created in a lab? You do. You do. That's the way. The way the cookie crumbles. I swear they said they added new bodies to the game, but I have not seen a new body. Maybe this is because we haven't seen enough yet. Shake, 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 shake. New body. Only one new body. Okay, that's why we haven't seen it yet. Can we do it on the second, second way through? Well, first we got our figure out where the marks are nothing on the back just chazzy thank you for the 21 months nothing. wondering if i'll ever do project zomboid again i've been waiting on the update for project zomboid they've been i don't know man that game gets updates <laughs> i'm used to phasmo which is like updates every um there we go What the fuck? I'm used to playing Phasmo, which gets like updates every few months, but Project Zombo, which gets like an update once a year, even though I think there's multiple devs working on that game. Like, I don't know. And it has an active community too. It like kind of blew up at one point. Everyone was playing Project Zombo and now everyone's waiting for the update, I think. I am personally waiting for the update. I want to get the NPC update. Like, that's what I'm waiting for. Because I don't want to do a whole series on that game if they don't have, like, and then do it again when the NPC comes out, right? I want to... I want to do it with the NPCs. You used to only get an update once every two years. That's crazy. NPC is going to be a while, really? But I want to play that game. It's just like there's not enough end game content for me in that game. Because it takes so much work to get there. And then once you're there in the end game and you're actually still fucking alive. It's all like, wait, what do I do now? There's nothing to do. And then it just kind of like... It kind of takes away from the, exp like the, the satisfaction of getting there. Okay, is that everything? I already have one of those. You have one of those, huh? But yeah, I did have a ton of fun with that game. Like, and I, I just the thing with that game is that it's so punishing. Like that it's a roguelike that takes you like a hundred plus hours per run. <laughs> it's like it's the well, it's not. I mean, it is technically a roguelike a little bit at least, uh, but like on crack. Because right. you, it, the runs take so long, and then you just, and then one mistake, and you're dead, and it's over. It's like, it's very, very punishing. It's crazy. Seven days to die. I got that game, but I never played it yet. I really want to play it. Okay, we need to get the, the machine, right? Yes. I have not, uh, I've not played it yet. I've heard it's, there's less to do, than in, um. Hello? Hello, Rebecca? Rebecca? What the? Subtitles? Hello? Subtitles? Any subtitles in the chat? What the fuck? You get seven days to die. Guess I got it. I have not played it yet though at all though. Um, and then we need the methanol. In the blood of a demon. 
Well, yeah, thank you for those strikes ones. I have this I, I already you have, have one, one of those. You have 1,000 hours in Project Zomboid. I have quite a lot of hours in that game as well. Like, I, I, I really enjoy that game. It's just because I don't have much time to play games, I get kind of like, it's just too... I'm missing something. You're missing something. You're missing the scalpel or what now? Scalpel? In here? What are you missing? What are you? You are missing the scalpel. Where is the scalpel? It's not that. What the fuck am I doing? That's an... If someone would have just kept them in the same spot, I wouldn't be in this fucking mess to begin with. <sighs> best game this year? I think this is the best horror game this year for sure. Like, just... I And I really, really want to see more games like this. Like, I need more games with random scare events that aren't just like stock sound stock noise jump scare yeah and replayable as what the fuck did the bot i swear there's something just happened with the body all kinds of creepy stuff just went down there. <laughs> I don't even know. <laughs> Let's get the hell out of me. I was not ready for that. <laughs> On the floor? On the ceiling? Where is it? Where is it? Wait, where the fuck is it? On the door? On the outside? Oh, it is. Zed. outside this one boom the dj the, the like disco noise happening every time now i need to do this which for that i need the bat hello oh huh? what oh that gave me goosebumps i do not like that what the fuck was that why did you say that rebecca what did you see that i did not uh oh, I don't, I hate it here. <laughs> I hate it here. Saw something. I think she heard something. I think so too. What are you hiding from us? Rebecca is seeing dead people. Well, I mean, she literally is seeing dead people. She's like looking at them right now. <laughs> That's kind of her job. There yeah. we go. Uh oh, not again. Uh, hello? I, I need to report a missing person. Uh, sorry, uh, her name is Rebecca Owens. She's 14. She, she, she has a drug problem. I, I, I don't know. Uh, she was here at the house. This is her dad, by the way. I understand that. I need you to check them. All right. All right. Uh, I'll keep an eye out. Thank you. So she... Do we getting so much... So she ran away. Because I didn't really put it all together when I first played. So she ran away at 14 because she had a drug problem at 14? Because her mom was addicted and got introduced her daughter to that because as you do as you do what the fuck like if you're 14 you should not be able to have <laughs> oh what the fuck uh, hello i need to report a missing person she she, she has a drug problem well the dad she has a drug you're sucked in the floor. Oh, this is it. This is so important. Finally, we can talk about this because we get to see it. So she ran away, landed somewhere in the middle of nowhere, and then this happened. Which I don't still, I just still don't why. Baby, no. It's okay. It's okay, too. 
you out of here. The police are, are just right, right up there. I, I, I'm coming back. I'm coming right back. Oh yeah, because they invited her to the beach. Hey, it's all hey, coming I'm together. Down I'm down stupid. Down <laughs> and he literally is that the story of the dad? The dad just literally fucking tripped. Is that is that what happened? The dad just <laughs> fell. I mean, <laughs> that's kind of a that's a fucking depressing way to go. He slipped. So now it makes so much more sense. The story up till now is the... We saw the part where the mom was gone and then her friends called, do you want to go to the beach, take your kit, which was uh, narcotics. And then she went to the beach. She got... Uh, bad stuff happened. She was lost or stayed on the beach there because we saw the water and the, the water uh, like flowing there. Like, that was obviously the beach. And then the dad tripped while searching for her and then passed away. So that's why she feels so guilty about it, because she was uh, directly involved in that. I see. I see. That makes so much more sense. And that's why she feels so guilty, because uh, she was a problem. Or, like, one of the reasons why it happened in the first place. Yeah, I thought it was her boyfriend, too. Like, I genuinely thought it was her boyfriend. That's why I was so confused. But no, it's, it's, it's dad. Nothing has happened with you, right? I need this lighter, too. Or the match, I should say. Yeah. Do, 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 do. All right. Okie dokie. Indeed. Two bodies done. I'm going to go for the third because none of these have done anything that is suspicious to us. So we're going to go for the third body. Also, I need to get achievements where I embalm a bunch of bodies, so uh, might as well do some work for that achievement. Because I think that's the last achievement that I have is like, embalm 50 bodies or something like crazy. Also, today I finally... I've been playing... Uh, if you have never played... There's a few games that have been huge in the past, but that have ki are kind of now past their like YouTube Prime. If you have never played, I mean, Minecraft is an obvious one, but then Minecraft got in this in Switch Prime. So if you have never played Minecraft, play Minecraft, obviously, that's just a given. Um, if you've never played Terraria because you thought it was too complicated, look up some videos on it and play Terraria. They fixed that! <laughs> they fixed that the one that's pulled out doesn't bang anymore that used to happen and it was like oh, what the fuck? It, it's so fucked up that was i did, did not expect comfort to you okay it's you uh you demon what the hell we found him we found the demon <laughs> holy shit Okay, then. Oh, here we go. Uh, what? Over at the back here? In this? Nope. On the chair? On the floor? On the ceiling? On the ceiling. In this? Yes, it's uh, the umbrella. Okay, with that, we should be able to figure it out. I think I'm gonna go for this lady. I'm gonna see if this is the if this is the demon. Also, we need to grab more stuff. I got those. I need to grab this and this and the this thing. Right? That's it. Or this is one. Okay. Now I want to get the ash and see if this is the lady. Because I mean, that seems extremely suspicious. We need the full thing. Yeah, we. I mean, we, she's the last one, so we have to. Uh, I think that's correct. Let's see, cause well, let, let's let's compare. So, we, which one do we have? We have the H, the Z, and the umbrella. Could that be right? Cause if it's right, I've been told it's just a hundred percent. Oh fuck you! What was the code? It was like a three three seven seven or something. Uh, what was it? Three, is it really that close? You guys are just... 
Give us the 3277. So close. 3277. Okay. Let's see. Do we have H, Umbrella, Invidious? Um, Cyber Age, no. Age, Umbrella, Z. It's the mass, mass it. Mass it? Okay. Umbrella, H, Z, Q. Umbrella. Umbrella, H. Uh, Q goes here. That goes there. That's the mark. All right. And then we put it on you because it's correct. Easy peasy. No, no demons. I mean, we still got to do the thing. I can't place it on you yet. Yeah, I, I, I should put the mark back real quick because we, we need to finish the embalming. 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 Because I haven't done anything yet. Got any marks? She got marks too? She moved, she got marks. All right, at least we're gonna get this. If this is not the correct body, I will, mark my words, become the Joker. Eight. She's like dr hearing party sounds. There we go. He is the chosen. Uh, there we go. So that's done. Okay, okay. Boom. 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 What was it? Oh! He's back, back again. Demon's back. Tale of friend. Oh boy. Smack, smack, smack. I was talking about games you should play if you, you like, games you can play for thousands of hours. Uh, Minecraft, obviously. There we go. Terraria. But then another game that I've recently discovered as like a gamer not as like knowing about it because i knew about this game and i played it in the past it's one of those games there's a bunch of games that i that i've heard of and then saw it and played it right. and then was like this is too complicated for me and then you come back another time of your life when you're like a little bit more advanced of a gamer and it like you're like holy shit how was i ever so stupid this is one of the best games i've ever played for me at the moment that's the binding of isaac especially with repentance there is just infinite content. I have been loving playing Binding of Isaac. It is so fun. I could even, I, once I get a little better, I might even do some YouTube videos on it because that shit is fun as hell. Um, I need to do this bag. And it's a very youtube -y game. But I, I just, I, I only win like a handful of times. And I'm, I'm like, I'm ass. I just, uh, I just take too much damage. I'm like slowly getting better at dodging. Um, what am I doing? Oh, I need to do this first. Oops. Um, but I did just unlock the beast. This is not going to mean anything unless you know what, <laughs> unless you know how repentance works. But I just, just unlocked the D6. Finally, I've been playing the fucking <laughs> game for so long. And now finally I have a good item that I can use which is gonna make my life a whole lot easier. Anyway, um, I need to do Humectant, which is where? Any Humectant in the chat? There it is. Behind me in real life. I play Binding of Isaac some more. I, I, I love that game. I'm like, if I have any time, I'm playing it. Although the runs are super long because I, I play it in a very grindy way where I want to just get as much, as many upgrades as possible. So I, um, I need a tubing. So I actually have, an, have a chance to win the game. I found this like random boss one time. It was called like Delirious or something. And I... Hey, it's your grandma. I need you to let me in. Oh yeah, you can let her in, right? 
Wait, I'm gonna. Don't you love your grandma? Can I wait? Do we open? Do we get? What? If... <laughs> to visit you. What the fuck, dude? <laughs> you me? I brought you something. I thought maybe you could slit your wrist for me. Hey! Just a little cut. You can't say that on YouTube anymore. What's wrong, Rebecca? <laughs> Rip YouTube watchers. <laughs> Don't be afraid of your grandma. <laughs> oh my God! <laughs> Get away! Jesus Christ! Oh shit! Well then. <laughs> well then. That is a little spooky. All right. Let's get the We even find the final sigil that is that is terrifying there are so many good events in this game i love this game it's just like i need more of this like this it imagine this and phasmo combined like so many events that are randomly generated that will be incredible turn the machine off hey Now we get the thing that I dropped on the floor because I, I keep forgetting that you need to do the machine first and then this. Courtney, thank you for the two months. Let's do it. Binding of Isaac is only five bucks on Steam. It's actually is only five bucks. <laughs> Wait, there's like a few games where I've had like my most like Quality or uh, playtime for money game I've ever purchased was Terraria. I think I bought it for like five bucks and I've played it for a there thousand hours. Like that is in that is insane value. <laughs> That's insane value. Um, I want to do the rest, which is cleaning and Binding of Isaac. Is you should get Repentance by the way. If you're gonna <laughs> play Binding of Isaac, you should get Repentance. Not the I don't. What the fuck? What? <laughs> Excuse me? I did not see that. Oh, here we go. Get tubing by bed. Tubing? Yes. Uh, get needle from bathroom. Check. Find lighter. Lighter. Get spoon from coffee table. If you weren't, uh, look at this is the sussiest spoon I've ever seen in my life. That's a sussy spoon right there. Uh, find the full baggie. Uh oh, no. though holy fuck run from it last time i tried to run from it and the whole game glitched so I, i'm not doing that again oh you can run away when i did that the whole game fucked up <laughs> so that's why i've been not been running from it okay you can run from it though I'll, if we ever see that again we're gonna do it again okay anyway i'm gonna clean this Oh boy, get the moisturizer. This is the body, right? Because the it's the correct symbol. It's gotta be the body. I'm just, we're gonna count on that working as intended. And she also talked to us and she had a symbol as well. Like it's gotta be this lady. Um, music, no, it's fine. We, we finished the game here, we win. 
All right. If you don't suck at this game, you can actually go so much faster. <laughs> but I, I, when I first played this, I kept failing because I was so bad. All right, here you go, Mark. You say something about it? Want to talk to me? Yes. Yes. <laughs> Are you sure this is the right one? Yes, I think so. Because the sigil is correct. And if it's not correct, then we've learned something about the game. Which I will gladly do that. Okay. Button. I'm a little scared. This be the correct one. Will I play the Cult of Misty again? That was like one of my personal favorite games of the year for sure. Talk about the Joker. What? You can still do this? Explode! Wait, it is outside this time? Wait, it, they can be outside? Interesting. Oh, never mind. Please tell me it's correct. And bye bye. It's Boonies. That was a cute. Wait, did we have the right one? Was that wrong? Oopsie daisy. Wait, we might have had it wrong. You've come a long way. Uh oh. It's nice not to be the Wait, one down. No, there this is wrong. <laughs> is it? Mr. Dover? I think you can just call me Raymond. Wait, no, this is correct. Do you always just pass out and wake up on the floor? It Wait. takes a lot out of you. I've Correct. never simply we did walked it? out of it. Let's go. <laughs> you get used to it. Let's go. With the right sigil as well. The floor is better. Raymond, will this ever end? Nice. Ending number two. I honestly two. don't know. I've been doing this a long time, Rebecca. I've traveled all over learning everything I can. I've never found anything that could put a stop to it. So no, I don't think it does. So we're just like this forever? Raymond, kind of evil, to, yeah. But this is the life we get. I mean, you forced this on me. <laughs> constantly. But the better we know ourselves, the stronger we are. Why don't you head home? Get some rest. Who knows what's coming tonight? Uh oh. What a Chad. I mean, he still. The fact that this guy still hires people, knowing that he's dooming them to eternal demon servitude, is insanely fucked up. <laughs> like, holy shit. Uh, Cosmic Castaway, thank you for the 10 months, and Toasty, thank you for the 5 months. There we go. We got a second ending. Three endings achieved. Two more endings to go. We did it correct twice. Let's go. <laughs> we are not done here. He's never said he's a good man. He's just trying to survive. I mean, he's just trying to survive by getting other people killed. That's pretty fucked up. Have I just tried leaving in the car? I have. Yes. Okay. So now I think we can grab these. I think so. Because the base... We need, still need the... Close your ears. Basement ending and the true ending, I think. Which we might... Let me just pick these up. Love you, Dad. Let's do that. Let's try those out. Need the key as well. So we're going to take those with us now. I don't know if you can sequence break that and do it earlier. I'm not sure. You need someone to patch to pass the torch to? No, because if he dies, then it's over. I mean, I guess if, if it continues... Then yeah, I guess maybe it's bound to this place. Like it's not really explained what caused it. Like, because it's not just happening all across the world, right? That's not what it's trying to imply. Okie dokie. Oh yeah, and the there's wait. Oh wow, it shows you that they're here. I'm gonna leave those here, I think. Because we can always pick them up when we need them. Because I know when we need those. But we don't have to have Please them in our inventory all the things. time. Also, did they swap their stuff around again? I think it's in the same spot this time. Why? 
the other setup was ten times better. I genuinely don't understand why they why they did this. Because it doesn't make any sense. The other setup was so much better. It made so much more sense. You're stupid. All right. Anyway, what's the code? The code is. 93489 93489 93489 93489 93489 Okay, that is done. Now get a body. Get give me some funny names. Last time we got so many legendary names. We need to get some legendary names. I'm gonna walk into a door, right? Which ones do we got? We have Dean Goodwin <laughs> with double E double N. Yeah, imagine being this. Imagine being called this. You have to say every time. Yeah, my name is Dean with a double E and a double N. <laughs> what? D N. Christine Benton. Will Cox. <laughs> Will Cox. <laughs> I'm starting with you, Mr. Will. <laughs> it's this guy. He's fucking haunted. It's Wilcox. <laughs> what Wilcox do? The name is haunted. There you go. I did not want to read that. I do not want to read your message. I wanted to close it. Okay, you got so many marks. What the hell? Even marks on the back. His legs are moving? Uh, yeah, they're shaking while you're moving the thing around. It's not actually like the, the demon, though, as far as I... As far as we know. He's stinky. There's marks everywhere. Oh, hi, Mark, on your feet. It's not done yet? What the hell? There we go. That's like seven marks. Just on every... Is that possible to get a mark? We just... Except the head, we got a mark on every single body part. I don't think I've ever had that. That is a lot. Um, and then... Whale. And... That's a lot of intel. Do, do, do. Didn't check the head. That's because I saw that there was nothing on it. Same guru. Thank you for the five more subs. Thank you. I feel like we're going through the game so much faster now. That's mostly because we're not making like a, a bunch of horrible mistakes at the start. Because we spent like five hours or something until we got it right for the first time when we first played this game. I was bad, okay? But it was so much fun. And it is still so much fun. Like, I. This is something so spooky about this. There we go. Very nice. All right. Because you're not like. There's people, but you're not with, like, real people. That's the thing. Like, it, it's alone in the worst way. <laughs> okay. Machine. That's a bleaching agent. Is that you? Did you say that? Because then uh, you're pretty sussy. We got a spirit box response. I think it's cabinet noise. Is he French? We'll never know. What is the bleaching agent? I, I don't think you ever use that. There's just stuff around that doesn't do anything. I haven't seen that event yet where one of these just like... Oh. Swirly. Where one of these just opens up by themselves. I hope it's this guy. That would be so funny. It is very loud. I don't know why they made that machine so loud. 
Can I really only get one? I've already embalmed the like almost a full body. Hello? Wait, oh this is the first one, never mind. There you go. We need the sack, which the sack's over here. Move. Wire the, I mean, you wire. The thing is that this is probably, I mean, this is simplified, especially like they, this machine is probably, this machine and this machine is probably really simplified. This w this is probably a like huge process doing this man There we go. It looked like he was breathing for a moment. I don't know if that was just me Okay, so let his chest moved while I was doing that thing. Hmm. Hmm. Clean it. <gasps> Will you help me? What the fuck? What the fuck? Hello. Nineteen seventy. Back, the year of arrival of the house of death, the birth of its creator. The full number shall be six. <laughs> the full number shall be six. That is a very important clue, as you need to remember. Nothing spooky going on here. You having a... I did not do the cleaning. Full number shall be six. I'm glad that they refill this and I don't have to do that. China main tea. Main knee. Thank you for the two months. Okay, so now you give me an extra one. Now you give me one, huh? It's the water droplet. Twirly twirl. Six becomes one. Oh, wait, what was the other one? Uh, it's this one and. Fuck. This one, right? The swirly. Peace. All right. Will Cox has been very uneventful when it comes to your own activity. Is that one of the bodies doing that? That's not the swirl. That is the swirl, right? What the fuck, man? Yeah, it is this one. Oh, it's a base. Is it from the basement? This is the new body. This is the new body. I think. I don't think we've seen this one before. Grandma. Is she actually gonna be old instead? Because all the, all the bodies, or look pretty young, and then you look at their age and they're like, eighty-two, an actual, full life lived. Let's go. Actual full life. Yeah, uh -huh, thank you for the donut biddies. Hey, hey, welcome. Callie, thank you for the three months. Nothing on your face. Boom. And leg. Shit. Uh oh. Yeah, now it, I mean, it's kind of crazy to think that. Oh, there's something on there. There we go. Uh, the people that are alive right now are probably gonna get like a hundred to like a hundred twenty thirty years old There's gonna be like so many old people like super old people because just the health like the medical industry has gotten so much So much better at keeping people alive 
I, I, uh, that's kind of cool though. Oh. What? Why did it not mark? It? There you go. Life expectation actually dropped. I mean, that across the board, they're not everyone's gonna be there, but there's absolutely gonna be some anomalies of like people that get like 120 to 130 because of just like people being cared for a lot close more closely um uh, it dropped because of COVID. yeah but that, that's what i mean i'm i'm talking about i'm talking about outliers here i'm not talking about uh like averages i'm gonna be a fucking 130 30 year old streamer i'm gonna be grandpa man and i'll still be streaming the ultimate grandma grandpa streamer <laughs> I'll never stop. Never stop. And then, because you know what's going to happen eventually, which is kind of crazy to think about. What's going to happen eventually? That a bunch of content creators are going to be so old, and then all their children are going to start taking over the YouTube channels. <laughs> so you have like PewDiePie the <laughs> second, who will be <laughs> like taking over. <laughs> Oh man. <laughs> Check Sectic Guy the, the second. <laughs> there we go. It's kind of interesting. Alright, um I am missing something. Oh you're not missing something. Alright. Do I want kids? Absolutely. There's gonna be a a baby in some, like, a few years from now, hopefully. And then they'll take over the channel when I'm, <laughs> when I'm 130. Uh, this one. And the demon blood, Marky Poo the first. I, if you didn't do that noise, I genuinely wouldn't have seen it. <laughs> that was very subtle. We'll see that with actors and musicians as well. No, I don't think it works that way. I mean, I mean, I guess you're seeing it to a point that actors are like the, the children of actors are better known, right? They, they like have a head start when it comes to being an actor, but it's not like they take a YouTube channel that has like a hundred million subscribers <laughs> like it's, it's not like quite literally the same like it's not literally passed on to the children they still have to like make their own career which I guess you still have to make your own career if you get a YouTube channel uh, but it's definitely going to be very interesting to see all big streamers over 30 don't have kids well, I mean, I guess what's going to happen a lot, too. That's going to be so interesting. Because what's going to happen a lot, too, is if you get, like, kids by the age of, like, 30, 35, like, between that range, the kids are going to be, like, old by the time you're old. <laughs> Which means you're... They might start their own YouTube channels and stuff. They might start their own YouTube channels and have like a base before. How is that? How is that gonna work? Can you like combine YouTube channels? <laughs> like, just merge them. Inherit YouTube channels, and I. <laughs> well then here we freaking go now we're getting more lore you thought we were done think again there very important look at this 1977 established and then 44 
bother. I'm gonna... What the fuck? Oh, we're getting like a tidbit of... What are you doing here? <laughs> Wait, we're seeing into the future? What the fuck? Isn't it? Oh, it's uh, when is this? Let's see. Can we already do this now? I need to continue this real quick. It actually remembered. So it was 70 on the picture, but maybe let's see. I'm going to finish this and then we'll, we'll try to fill it in. Cause like, how did we see that? Cause I feel like it, the demon shows you. I mean, maybe the demon shows you things that the demon also knows, right? There we go. Okay. So over here, we've seen this earlier, but we, I didn't really pay attention or didn't really, uh, make note of it. One, nine, 70, 44. Hatch key. We got it. Let's go. I want to see. Also, we take the old key, which is underneath here. Bada bing, bada boom. Oh boy. It was not 19. The fuck? I'm gonna just leave you there and go. Because we got stuff to do. The hatch. We have not been to the basement in this playthrough yet. Nope. But we're just going to now. Hatch key. Here it goes. And then it now this is where you get so much lore. Mr. Delver, it is a great shame I will not be- wait. Oh, we need to- we need to start from the beginning. Dear Mr. Sala, it was a pleasure- wait, no, 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 I want to- where's the beginning? Let's play the tape. I'm missing something. You're missing something? What do you mean? Oh. May? I think this- I think the- I think the diary is the first part, right? This is- yeah, this is- uh... Wait. Is this a year after? Oh yeah, this is many years after, okay. Um, I think we're gonna start with a diary, right? Oh, there's a tape, cassette tape. Play the cassette tape first. Or is this the, I should be killed on side tape? This is Raymond Delver. Yes. I, I know this will sound crazy. No, we're gonna get this information. There's no recap, we're getting it all here. Goodbye. Okay, now we get so D. It, obviously, Raymond knows a bunch of stuff. So let's see what Raymond knows. May 29th. I'm not sure why I've decided to write this down. I don't keep journals, but it may be the only way I can deal with what's happened. To get my thoughts out. I thought this, or to get my thoughts out. I thought this was over, but it's happened to David. I remember so vividly what it looks like. I don't have any plan here. I just wanted to write. June 3rd. I keep thinking about David. I feel horrible. What he became was terrifying. I remember everything, but I haven't seen it in a living person before. I knew in my gut what was happening, but I couldn't believe it. It's been almost two decades. When the body came in, David almost instantly began to become ir irritable. We both knew something strange was happening, but it directly affected him. He felt sick and went home for the day, only to return that evening saying that he felt he had to come back and he wanted to work. At that point, I couldn't ignore it. I tried to tell him he was in danger, but this was all all real. 
that this was all real. He insisted on working, became ir ir irrational again, and asked to work alone. I again told him what to look for, but he dismissed me. I went and bought a camcorder and told him to at least record anything unusual. I wanted to be able to show him once he was in a moment of clarity so that he may, he would, he may be, so that maybe he would allow me to help him, but it all happened so fast and was over. April 3rd. I don't know what else to do. I feel helpless. I'm so sorry. James now, new name. August 10th. Andrea now, new name. It won't stop. I don't know what to do. Obviously, not everyone is susceptible. I've learned that, that much. It makes me want to never hire anyone again, but I can't lose the mortuary either. Even if I did close, it would still happen to me eventually. So he keeps hiring people that <laughs> turn into demons or that get possessed because of the mortuary being possessed. November 16th. I'm back to writing here again. It's been so long. I thought it was over, but I guess I've just been lucky. I'm scared I was hoping this would... I'm scared. I was hoping this would never happen again, but I have a feeling this is only going to happen more. Poor Angela now. This is a horrible existence. I almost fell victim before. It's only a matter of time now until it chooses me. I don't want to be alone, but I think there's no escaping what has happened. I will miss you always. Maria, another name. <laughs> But it was the right thing to leave you to keep you safe. I know you would never understand. I tuck uh, February 20 22nd. I tugged this journal away and forgot about it trying to move on I found it again today, and I guess I have been in a horrible place for a while now I can't live with all this guilt. I feel so alone I feel so angry at the life that's been taken from me. I stopped my life to take care of her and she brought this She brought this in Take care of her Maria is wife i can't blame her that's not fair it's not her fault i have to find a way to stop this myself i've just been sitting here huddled in fear hoping this won't happen again that it won't happen to me i don't have much money but i need to start researching this in a real way i need to take control next page i've been working relentlessly and believe i have made some progress i haven't pieced together much but i have found enough that has led me to a contact in egypt i'm flying out there a few days in a few days to meet and talk about what's ha been happening april 29th my trip to egypt was extremely successful i feel i'm broke now but it was worth it mr sala is an amazing amazing help i've come back with mountains of documents and copies of religious texts i had no idea existed it's changed a lot of what I believe. I'm going to start pouring over these and see what I can piece together. There's something here. I can feel it. December 8th. I'm so tired and angry. I feel so helpless. I can't do this anymore. Valerie didn't do anything to deserve this. None of them did. I can't bring myself to do it. I'm keeping Valerie here. I can't help her. I'm sure of it. I feel like I'm so close to something that can stop this, but I don't know what I'm missing. I've been working on a number of things meant to combat these entities. I have found ways to uncover their sigils, which is promising. I have distilled this down to a science, and I know I can find the missing piece. I will help you, Valerie. So Valerie, not necessarily dead. I hate what I have done, I, what I have to do. I have to feed her and care for her, even though she is violent and gone. It is far too similar to how this all began, and I hate it. So, wait, this is actually giving me more context now, too. So, yeah, in fact, maybe his wife was possessed and was his wife maria then so maybe his wife was possessed no 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 probably not maria but his wife was possessed valerie was his wife but so he says like how this all began right how this all began and then because the wife brought in the demon then i'm guessing it's far too similar to how this all began and i hate it god damn it 30 years of this i have a th no so 30 years of this this is way earlier than that it happened i have a theory that i don't and I don't like it, but I can't let this happen to anyone else. This has to stop. I have some things I've been working on that I am going to send off to Mr. Sala to get his opinion. If it's a viable method, I'm going to, to take this head on. If I can't stop it, I'll keep it at bay. February 18th, I received some great news from Mr. Sala. I've been fortunate enough to not have another compromised body up to this point, but now I need one. My plan now is to work in the mortuary alone until this happens again. If I can establish myself as a potential conduit and survive the possession, using these tools, I think I may be able to take control as well as keep this from happening to others. I don't know what this means for Valerie. It's only a pi it's on the only piece of this I don't know how to live with, but I might have to. Otherwise, it's all been for nothing. Okay, now let's read these, which are documents sent to Mr. Sala. 
Dear Mr. Shala, it was a pleasure working with you, but I'm sorry to say that I simply can't afford to travel back out to you. I have more questions about Athenians, about the Athenian translations, but I was also hoping you could send over the documents you had shared on the quarter on quarter letting. Honestly, any documents you could create copies of and send would be extremely helpful. The package accompanying this letter contains some of the clay carvings I have made in an attempt to create the symbols you shared. I have also designed a holder for them. My hope is to combine the markings and holder to comp comp to compromise a demonic to comprise a demonic identifier that will also call the entity to it and bind it there, if correct. The silver capsule in the center of the holder contains the ash of burned co cofris and is lined with demonic calling rooms. Based on our conversa conversations, I believe this can react with fresh blood from the possessed. I wanted to request that you give the contents of this package a look and let me know if this seems like a viable method to bind an entity. With privacy also being extremely important to me, I wanted to request you please send everything back, including this letter, which is why we can read it now. Dear or Mr. Delver, it is a great shame I will not be seeing you, but I appreciate you sharing this with me as it does seem to provide a reaction and what, wait, as this does seem to provide a reaction and what you have made does make sense. It's a very clever way to identify a specific entity. However, I am curious as to the reason for the body identification aspect as you would need the blood of the possessed inside the vessel, which I assume would already be the case and tenancy would be obvious. So I don't really see the value of identifying the vessel. However, the demonic identification and binding aspects of this is fantastic. Okay, so this is actually extremely important, which I don't really think I understood the first time I played. Um, so what he is saying here the blood should already be in the demon, right? The blood should already be in the demon because it's the demon, like, because the body is possessed. However, what I think is happening is that we are possessed. So we are, the people are possessed and we're trying to bind the people to a certain body that wasn't possessed before. So we're trying to bind it by putting blood of the demon in there, like putting the blood artificially inside the body to then bind it to that body so we can burn it. So we're trying to get the demon out of us into the bodies and then we keep getting possessed and we try to like, so these people are basically never been possessed. So they, they were not possessed uh, and we just burn the bodies in like this kind of <laughs> this, this disrespecting way to get rid of those demons on us instead. So that's why, because there were like so, so many people that were like upset in the comments. Oh, this game is <laughs> so evil, which I, I didn't understand until now. But yeah, there you go. Thank you for sharing your, which is why Mr. Salah is confused because he is under the assumption that you're just burning demons. But no, we're actually taking demons out of ourselves and pu putting them, binding them to bodies, which then can be burned. Thank you for sharing your work. It's a great help to mine. As you have requested, I have returned everything with this shipment. With great respect, Akil. Akil Salah. There you go. And now in here... We're gonna... Are you out there? Oh, hello. Oh, I knew you'd find me. I'm so alone and I'm scared. Scared. Didn't you hear me? <laughs> yeah, so what I don't understand while we are talking to Valerie is then why do we have to burn a specific body? But like I don't understand why we have to put the blood in there if the blood if the demon is if, like if the body is possessed, there's already blood in there. I guess there need, you need to refresh the blood because the blood is like old or something. I don't really know because so because if we do have to we do have to burn maybe the blood is old. Maybe that's it because that would make a lot more sense why the demon like why we have to burn a specific body and why the demon does like stuff around the body all the time. So it's trying to take over Rebecca, which is still similar like. Okay, so it's trying to take over the person in the mortuary, which is either Raymond or Rebecca or any assistant that he's had. And we're using Valerie here as a way to get live demon blood so we can then... Because apparently it only works for if the, if the demon is alive. Okay, so yeah, there you go. Can you help me get me the fuck out of here? 
Raymond here? Do you see what he's doing? Who could do this to someone? I think you should let me out. Let me out, let me out, let me out, let me out. Get out your fucking eyes! I'm going to cut you open and stuff the burning embers of this fucking building and you will kill you back for death! <laughs> Jesus You'll be Christ. Here soon. You'll be here soon. What a what a foreshadowing. Because she thinks it will fail and then Raymond might have to <laughs> So this is yeah, there you go. That's so cool. But they can like when we turn into a demon, we like force field destroy Raymond. Why didn't she do the same? She can still probably do that with her hand here, right? I don't really understand. Anyway, uh so much information. That was it. That was I think there's nothing else here. Uh, I think we got everything. So yeah, that is all the lore around Raymond, who has been getting new assistants over and over again, help like to help the, him, and constantly they keep getting possessed and pass away. And we're the first one who's actually been living it, or been surviving it. Um, yeah, not in every ending. No, 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 I know. There you go. Well, we can actually get that. No, can't we? Can't we get that ending? Because it's not a real ending, right? It's just a, like a failure state. Did we already finish this fight? Almost. We need to... The, wait, yeah, we need to do this. So I think if we just randomly burn one, it'll just... It'll give us that ending. So we can actually see it. Which I think will be interesting. So why don't we try that? So we do... I'm pretty sure that's how it works. Let's clean this. So if we just burn this one, we're gonna see what that ending looks like. Which, oh wait, I don't want that. Whoopsie daisy. I want the moisturizer. And then we get to continue from there anyway. <laughs> what the fuck? Okay, it's the H. H. Oh. So we're... Is this gonna auto save here? Newy, thank you for the prime and G Lin Gaming, thank you for the tier three, seven or six months. Thank you. All right. There it goes. So it's saved, right? <laughs> it won't work that way. What I'm gonna do now, because I think it uh, it didn't auto save yet. So what I'm gonna oh wait, let's just leave this body out here. Um, did I do that one? Did I do Dean? Wait, have I done two bodies already? Wait, hold on. The feet moved. I don't didn't see it. Oh, what's this Wilcox? This is Will Cox, right? This is Cox. Yeah, okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> of course I did. So I want to get the autosave to happen here. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to place this body to get the autosave. Right here. Boom. Then it saves because the icon is in the bottom. Then we take the body again, and now I want to fail. So I, I think this is how I did it last time. Can I please pick you up? But I can't pick you up while you're in this state. I need to do the investigation first. Interesting. I didn't even know that was the case. I didn't know that was how it worked. I have to do this. Oh. No symbols yet. We we don't have any idea who the demon is, or I don't. I click that. I love how you can click that from the wrong side, and then it'll actually show up on the wrong shoulder too. Like look at that. There's two on the left shoulder, which I don't think that's I don't think that's true. Boom. There you go. Wait, eighty-two? 82? 
Was that the age? Oh no, it's 20. This one's 82. This one's 20. <laughs> I was like, what the hell? You look young for a dead 82 year old. Is this gonna give me a save point as well? At least. I don't know if it does. I don't think it does. I can still not pick it up? I'm missing something. Wait, how confusing? Wait. Why can't I move the thing? Eh. When you're in the embalming process, it can't be moved at all? I did not know that. <laughs> you have to... They changed that. They definitely changed that, didn't they? Or have I just never tried that before? I'm pretty sure that didn't used to be the case. But maybe I'm wrong. Um... I feel like that did not used to be I'm the case. I'm missing something. You're missing something? Wait. Oh, this... Maybe it was causing a bunch of bugs, and then they fixed that with this process. Yeah, it broke the game when you did. That's why I was breaking the game so much, because I was doing all kinds of stupid shit that the game didn't want me to do, which is, like, bring bodies back and forth <laughs> that you, like, halfway through embalmed. There we go. Okay, now I understand a little bit more why my first experience was so fucking janky. All right. So we gotta finish this. We can't just randomly burn one now. You hate this part? Oh boy. Nothing has happened in a while now, has it? It's a little quiet in town. Boom. Look at this speed run though, by the way. All of them could be seen. My coming shall herald glorious sorrow. I will greet the flesh of the man for my own. Three houses and homes of hell. Two will be considered in my house. One I need to usher to duration. I have come. I think we found it. Imagine if Will Cox said that. That would have made it all new. <laughs> Um, I think she's I think we found her Unless this is not this might this is a story event, right? So this might not be the demon. But we can always use the ashes, right? Oh, you creeps you creeps That's kind of sick Ugh. Go back to hell I love how when you try this, it's just like. You killed him. You threw away his love with your selfish sin. In his final moments, he regretted you. Be more comforting. <laughs> Just let me go, Rebecca. It won't be over. <laughs> that is let me in as in like, let me take over a living person. Wow. Uh, yeah, that does make a lot more sense. So we did, the demon is trying to possess from the bodies into Rebecca. And showing like the the that the darkest part of their uh of their past wow okay i have not heard of the machine i don't know if that's related to her or if, like if uh this body is extra cursed now or if it's just the story event that happens but <laughs> that is all that uh! What the fuck, dude? Just 
helping? That scared the hell out of me. <laughs> what the fuck? Well then, um, I'm going crazy mode. Rimson, thank you for the sub. I have not encountered the bug, by the way, today. So yeah, they did, in fact, really fix it. She's really besides herself. Huh? She's having an out-of-body experience. They fixed it just for me. The future. There we go. There we go. I wanna... That was one of the major events, but there's still another. We we have to do at least, like, one more run for the true ending. Because I think five runs is optimal. If you want to get the, like, 100% experience. Because, obviously, you have to get five endings. Don't smile at me like that. Are you cursed? We still need to figure out who it is. How cursed are we? Oh boy. <laughs> oh boy. We are very cursed, turns out, huh? Is it gonna save after I do this? All right. There you go. So it does save. Nice. So I could actually s let it be here. And I don't have to. Okay. Anyway. Um. So if I burn the now, if I burn now, I'm just gonna get an ending. I can't do like the game over ending right now. We're gonna have to do that on the next run, I think. Because if I just do that now, like if you burn without a mark, do you get the game over ending? I don't know. I think when you embalm all the bodies, you can't get like a game over state anymore. It's just gonna be ending three then. So I don't think we should do that because it would be bad. Let's see, do we have any, any symbols anywhere? I think it's this lady. <laughs> Let's try it, huh? I think it's you. So let's see if you get the right. That was a demon symbol. You just put the. Yeah, we're gonna do this now. Excuse me. I did not see what I was supposed to see. Um, I want to get the light. Something was happening. Do I have all the symbols? I do. I think I have enough. Okay, uh, ashes and that's the wrong symbol. So that means they're not this one, right? That means it's not this one. So this is the wrong body. Then. We agree with that, right? Wait. Yes, right? It's uh, one of the other ones. Unless, wait a minute, what? What symbol is this turning into? I need to... Wh which ones do I have? Wait, 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 one second. Back. Fuck. Um, I have these three. So let's see if it is that one. If I go here, we have... Wait, which one? Twirly... Or Twirly, Water Droplet, and the H. Whirly wa or water dro oh so it is this one. Never mind. It is correct. Okay. So the one that I turn into, the one I am drawing is not this. Wait. Because this is correct, right? No other has tw let's see. Does any of the other have this combo? I doubt it. Let me see. Uh desolation. Does that one have it? Twirly not water droplet on this one not on this one so none of these and twirly twirly water droplet but no h so it is in fact that house so it is correct so it is the correct body then it's got to be because we've been we've been counting on this Man, that is, the fact that they changed that is, uh, unless I was just misunderstanding, but I feel like it was changed. That is huge. So it's H, Twirly, Water Droplet. Here we go. We get the other one. So we did that. We left last time. Now we can stay in something new. I'm not leaving. I'm not letting you in. No, uh, uh. 
Don't you love your grandma? It's so cold out of here. No! Close the door. Let me in. I knew it was gonna happen, it still got me. Fuck you. Okay, anyway, uh, what was that? It's H twirly water. H twirly water. And then this one, right? Oh god, is this the music? Uh, yes. Okay, so that's the correct one. And then this should be the body. Take mark. This is it. What are you gonna say, huh? You're wrong, you know. Oh, you think so? Well, how about... Wait, I can't touch it. I can't touch the body right now? I have to get the mark off before I can touch the body again? Well, fuck you then. I'm going. I got it. This guy's just trying to... Reverse psychology me. I, er... <laughs> your tongue is clipping through your chin. That's messed up. Also, how are you opening your mouth? Oh, uh, what the fuck? Well, um, no, no, thank you. No, thank you. You was just chilling? I'm sending you to the shadow realm. I'm sending you back to hell. Go back where you came from. Leave us alone. Now, I don't know if this is gonna change. Uh-oh. Back to where you belong. I think we dead. We have that. That has to be correct, unless we've just been fluking it this whole way. Oh, Cox is gonna come around the corner. No, 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 I just saw you. Put the C4 in the oven. You shouldn't put it in there. No, Raymond. Oh. I'm here. Here we go. I can't. Yes! Believe. The basement ending! What you've been doing is monstrous. I've said already that I've had to accept everything about Let's go. myself. Just like you do. You this is it. a necessary evil. Sick. She's down there right now, just suffering for no reason. Valerie is not down there. Not anymore. She's been gone for years. You don't know that. You're just gonna let her stay there. You don't know what she's feeling. You are torturing her. She's helping me survive. She's helping us survive. Yeah, because you made me into this. Without her, there's no reagent. Without the reagent, we have nothing. You want to have a chance at life, it comes with a cost. This cost. Well, that's because of you. <laughs> you have to make a choice, just like I did. What choice? Keep her alive to just bleed her over and over again to save ourselves? If she can't be saved, end the torture. But she's down there suffering for your own gain. My gain? My gain. You used her to wow, didn't stop dude. you from finishing the job. <laughs> That's some you bullshit. You used her blood anyway. When it came down to it, you chose survival. <laughs> yeah, because just you like would have just got someone else to do it. Like, you're the, <laughs> you're the master evil Knievel. I know it's the right thing to do for her. I know. How is this she game made by one person, one. right? Yeah. 
I've seen many experience what you did. None have survived. I've watched them degrade and suffer until they're no longer themselves. I didn't know what else to do. I couldn't just let them suffer. I searched for years to find a way to reverse it. All I found was the way to prevent more. Isn't that better than nothing? I've killed them all, Rebecca. <laughs> was the only thing I could do. Sure, he killed all of the <laughs> other so, yes, previous ones. I am a monster. <laughs> and they were starting to get but possessed. this one horrible thing has prevented <clears throat> me from having to take any more life. And I would choose that again. First assistant was the one again. who started this? I can't live with any more death than I already do. I've made peace with it. The choice is yours if you can too. I'll see you tomorrow. Mm -mm. In the tutorial, I was already in trouble. There you go, ending four. Look at that. We are, we actually have a positive kill death ratio in this one now, <laughs> instead of being like completely in the negatives on our previous playthrough. There you go. Now we still obviously have the absolute most important ending, which is ending number five. So let's continue. We're not done here. We are not done. And I also would like to get the game over state. Let's try to get a game over this time so we can see what happens if we... If we can see what happens. So the difference between ending three and the game over states is that in the game over states, Raymond knows we didn't try it at all. So he knows that it's... That we are going to be possessed. So then he just does whatever he's going to do when we show it here because I'm not going to spoil it. Um, but in the ending three, he thinks we got it correct, but then we got it wrong in the end. So that's why he ends up getting killed by us when we're the demon, because he thought we got rid of the demon, but we did not. Anyway, we're back once again. Now, with this being my main goal, I think I can do it. Nah, I think I don't have need it. Because whenever it happens, I can grab them, I'm pretty sure. So yeah, I don't have to do that. It's like a time event. Anyway, um, hopefully we'll get it. I think they're forced. I think, they don't keep track of things. I think they're forced to happen on the, on the nights where you can get the secret ending or the true ending. But you get the game over. We're going to try and do that now. Shoot Mouse, thank you for the two months. And Boss Mobber, thank you for the six months in advance. Thank you. Just burn them. Uh, no, you, you don't. Here we go. We have Samuel Beasley. We got Noel Ar Noel Armstrong. And we got Tajuana Magia. Oh, that's an exotic name. Like, I've never heard of that name. It's, a it's raining every night. Yep. Hello. What am I trying to do right now? We have to get the true ending. The ultimate ending. So does that no everybody can turn into into the dad right i'm pretty sure anyway i hope we get the other one i will have to censor it for youtube though <laughs> but we'll see we'll see anyway i have to deal with this it, 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 the fuck? they swapped it around again you ass what are you doing zoe go eat shit i already have one of those oh my god zoe Go fuck yourself. <laughs> I hate you. <gasps> Why? Uh, where's my scalpel? Where did you leave my scalpel, Zoe? What the fuck? <laughs> I hate you. It's not there. In here? No. In there? No. Uh, wait, is it there? On the ceiling? Is it in? It can be in one of these, right? Wait, where? Legit though, where's the scalpel? Oh, underneath, maybe? No, oh, that's the. What? Oh, here. No, those are the. Oh, here! They're on the in the window. Okay, thank you. Look. Look, I'm blind. Okay, I'm stupid. Excuse me. Excuse me. Don't do that. Don't cry. For me, Argentina. Diabol Di Diab Diabolic. 
for the 11 months. Hey, hey boss member, welcome to the Twitch stream. Oh, there we go. Here we go. No crying. Uh, we did not unlock that yet. 36 again. Uh, please. Oof. 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 What is... Please give me the event. I don't want... I mean, we could still get the, the game over endings. Which is gonna be fun. Or interesting to see. Because now with the added context, I actually... Like, I did not fully... I mean, I could... Did I not close the door? I did understand the game before, but I didn't fully get every part of it. And now I do. Now, because now everything is clear. There are only five endings. Yeah, there's only five endings that give, like, true endings. But there's still two other things that can happen. When, like, like they're game overs. They're not endings, but they're game over state. It's just, they're still, like, cutscenes, basically. That's, they're, like, ending cutscenes. So hopefully we'll get those. I think we can... I there forgot how to get both the exact... Because they're very similar endings. They're very similar. Um, okay. Get the... All of this now. Uh, can I do this? Oh, I have to do your... Your eyeballs. Alright. Now I can do this. Hello? Hello. Rebecca? Rebecca? What the? Um... Is that gonna trigger another thing? I need this one. And uh, this one. I wonder if this is like a random setup. I'm guessing it is. I don't know why the dev did that though. That feels so... That feels so evil to randomly spawn where the items are. <laughs> Like, that's mean, man. No subtitles? Sometimes there's no subtitles on those things for some reason. <gasps> Here we go! Sure, YouTube, you can't see this, but this is definitely the one that I need. Okay, now we grab the coins. Because we didn't get this one last time. So you're just seeing a blur right now, but we're supposed to go here. And then... Do... This, this, and this. We give the coins to her. Yes. I think that's it. I think we just did it. So you just give the coins to that when the age restriction thing happens. That I can't show you. I'm sorry. <laughs> if YouTube wasn't so uptight, we could. So now I feel like that's it. We're getting it. <laughs> Let's go. And that's the one that I didn't get last time. Because last time I got it in a different way. I got it with the dad the dad necklace instead. Boom. Okay. Easy. It's the... We have literally... This is the hook. Maybe this is a different... Uh demon house this time because i feel like we've only gotten it from the same demon house like every single time yeah we still need to get it correctly which we could definitely get it wrong however we do have the ash right the ash makes it the ash is honestly almost too op <laughs> it's like almost too strong in figuring out what the demon is but hey i won't complain it is extremely useful for me Yeah, I don't... Because I saw that 8 Ryan didn't play this game because he was... Like, he didn't want it to get age-restricted. Man, I would still... Like, I don't know. I, I know it's... I mean, I know it from being a YouTuber and streamer myself. Like, streaming is a job. Like, you have to pick games. Like, I don't get to play every game that I want to play. Because some games just don't go. fit for YouTube or uh, they're too long or something like that. Uh, but I... Man, if 8 Ryan... You gotta play it. <laughs> it's so good. Like, I I think you can get it past the age restriction. Like, I've I one of my videos is still not age restricted, 
and I'm gonna try to get I mean it might get age restricted anyway if it does get age restricted in the first few hours I might re-upload it I don't know it's, I didn't put it in the machine it's just kind of stupid, man, that this game especially is getting targeted. I think YouTube just eventually... Because it happened all at once for everyone. Like, the videos were all doing fine, and then all of a sudden, every single video that was on this game just got age-restricted out of nowhere. So I feel like the... the maybe I shouldn't make... Maybe I should, like, not flag it as... <laughs> I should, like, pretend it's a different game or something. <laughs> like, I should put it in the wrong game category. <laughs> So that YouTube doesn't know it's this game or something. I don't know, man. Like, why do we have to jump through these hoops? Just tell us what's wrong with the footage and we can fix it. Like, oh I didn't God. finish that explanation, but like, if they would just, if you get age restricted, they would just show you like, hey, in this portion of your video, uh, our bots have detected something that uh, is has age restricted your video. But that's not how it works. It's just like a, it's just rent. It's just like. Oh, your whole video is age restricted now. And then you appeal it and it says, yeah, manually reviewed. Within like five minutes, it'll say, oh, it's been manually reviewed. Even though it's like a four hour video, it'll say like, yeah, no, no, no. It's manually reviewed. Like, it doesn't make any fucking sense. It's stupid as hell. Critical did a video on it. Literally everyone did a video on it. I think Jack made the... Like, Jack basically summarized all of the points in this video, so if you want to... If you want to really get to the bottom of everything... What is it? Uh, what? Oh! What the fuck was all of that, man? Was that even one singular event, or was that just a chain of a bunch of events? I- there's never been an appeal that has gotten accepted. I think- I think it's impossible to get your appeal accepted. I don't know. It's like a manual review, but it's not actually a manual review at all. Like, I- I don't know, and no one buys that. <laughs> no one- I mean, some people do, but even though it says it's a manual review, no one buys- no one buys that it truly is. It's- it's fake. Obviously, it's, it's like impossible to do it that fast and there's not that many employees working for YouTube. Anyway, it's uh, there we go. It's something that's been going on for a long time now, the whole age restriction thing. Like there's just videos that randomly get restricted out of nowhere. The worst part for me, or like in my opinion, is that it happens like a few hours. Like usually it's like YouTube bullies you. Because usually it happens like a few hours after the video goes live for the first time and then you can't appeal it like it never goes away which is just really annoying i wish they would show it before the video went up can you freaking work as intended thanks the fact that they only do it after the video is already live is just incredibly frustrating yeah they do it like one to six hours after the video goes live which means you're basically stuck leaving it up and just having, like, the video be completely dead. It's so annoying. Like, it's an... It's an... Unacceptable system from a... From a creator perspective. You filled your delirium run? I... Did not even know I'm what was going something. on. You're missing something? And that's Zoe's fault. Fuck you, Zoe. Eat shit. Uh, I already got these. The scalpel is over here. I'm blaming I'm so I don't something. you're missing something still what I mean oh this I got these no there we go now I can do it boom yes there we go oh Rebecca We get a repeat! That does happen, so... Head over to Grandma. Head over to Grandma. Oh! No, 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 this makes sense. It's not Grandma. That's why, now I understand why you guys thought it was Grandma. This was 
head over to grandma is like the dad trying to get the child away from seeing the mother. Mom. Yes. I have to touch it now, but it wasn't. You stupid bitch. Hate me all you want. He's dead because of you. You should be the one here. Lifeless. Worthless. Give it to me. <laughs> Give it to me. <laughs> Give it to me. The crackling noises, yeah. Okie dokie then. Boss Mommer, thank you for the 10 gift subs. Thank you so much for all the subs today. <laughs> you guys are too nice. Thank you. Boom. That's bleach. I don't need that. Um, down there. Boopity boop. The next sounds make you concerned. Oh, there's a... A lot of sounds in this one that should make you concerned. <laughs> Especially the one with the filling the body. That one's that one's fucked up, man. Alright, we need the tubing. I hate that's man, that would go on. And this one also. Can you hear that? Something's up. This is our second body. We should definitely get the second sigil, thank you. outside again so it is it's the Q. Q, yes so i'm gonna just this is our wait no is this our first one no first body or have i already embalmed one because i should really try to get for the i should try to get the failure states I, I was playing too well i was focusing on actually beating the game but we want to get the game over so oh oh my god Jesus Christ. That, that spooked me. Okay. Um, the Q, right? Yes. So we're going to burn you without. We need to do the, the, the tubing now. Or this thing now. Which is where again? In here. Yes. You don't like that one? Oh boy. Yeah, this is the best sound. Game over secret. Game over ending is like you get it for free because you get at least last time. I don't know if they changed this, but it's a game over. It's not an actual ending. So you can just continue after you get it. It's just like, so you're like a temporary failure state. I hope it doesn't mess up the true ending. I'm guessing it doesn't. You've got the event. Yeah, but I go. think it should be. Able, I mean, we could just I don't want to. I want to end on the true ending. I guess the other endings are just failure state. So it's not really special okay so we did that now we need to clean the pump i'm pretty sure you can do that and we can always get it again if it does end up going wrong right because i feel like they give you the events more once you have once you have finished uh the other endings i think you get those events a lot more okay and then i need the moisturizer which is over here you did dirt lord thank you for the prime joe i should say peekaboo yes so now I, i'm i'm a little scared does anyone know how exactly it worked i know psycho made a video on it how do you exactly get those uh game over states like if i just burn this body without a sigil is that gonna give it to me or not no how do you got it? You run. No, you don't run out of time. Running out of time is one of them, but the other one you burn way too early. I think that's how it works. What the fuck is going on? Grandma, please. Yeah, we need this true ending, but we also want the game over. Just to see. I'm just gonna try. I feel like this works. Because I this, it's how I did it in the past. So, and if it fails, then so be it. We'll just do it again. Because we can't do it again. 
but I'm pretty sure this gives you the game over. If you just burn this without a si symbol on it, I think it goes, you get a special ending. Let's put it to the test, science time. We'll see, we'll see. And if it doesn't work, then whatever, we'll just do it again. Yes, yes, okay, good, nice. It actually works, so there you go. That's Now you have a little guide for you if you want to try it out yourself. There you go. So you put the body in without this mark and you get this special, special ending. Or you get a special game over. Yes. Where am I? What happened? Let me go! Hey, what are you doing? I'm sorry. This is the only way. go is he gonna come back Jeez. oh there he is and boom that is not an ending officially it is basically what happens if you it's what happened to all the other or no not necessarily to all the others all the others got killed because raymond is crazy um but when he knows you're possessed so we actually continue on the same night now if all goes according to plan um because we, he knew we were possessed since we didn't even try to do it properly, right? We didn't try to do his ritual where we did, like, the, the mark on it and everything. So we didn't do the proper thing. Oh, no, it does. They actually changed the way that worked. Okay, it's fine. But because back in the day, back when I played the game, when it first came out, it would then allow you to just continue from from where you where you ended, where you did this. But that's fine. We can get it again. I wanted to show you that because that, that was basically another ending. There's another one exactly like that, which is if you let the time run out. If you let the time run out, it uh, also gives you one of those, but it's slightly different. But I'm obviously not going to wait that. I'm not going to wait for that. That's too long. So, yeah, if you want to... It's basically the exact same ending. I got it in my playthrough when I first played this game. Which, yeah, there you go. Back in the day a month ago. I mean, that is back in the day <laughs> back in back when 1905 what names do we got though hilario hilario lawrence he's hilarious frederick sims twisted herbals <laughs> what the fuck she's kind of twisted all right we're just gonna start at the beginning what a kind of name is that I'm glad we didn't fully finish that one though. So we got the we got the ending early on. Now we need to get the secret ending though. Here we go. We'll get it right. All right, hi, hi friend. There's multiple ways you can get the secret ending. One was the one that I got there, and there's also another one which I got in uh, my original playthrough. I forgot to pick this up. I also forgot things. to pick this up, I think. Did you grab the coins? I did, right? Let me make sure, because without that, you can't do it. I'm pretty sure I did. I did. And the code is 59206. 59206. Interesting that they made that an ending, though. Um, 59206. Because previously, as I said, when you got to a game over... You would then be allowed to continue from where you got the game over, which they changed. It didn't really make a lot of sense, so I, it made sense that they that they changed the way that worked. But anyway, that wasn't how it worked when the game first came out. That's why I, I felt confident trying it out. But at least we saw it. If there was an ending where you led Valerie out. There could definitely be more endings, but like, this game was made by one dev. And there's there so go. much content, it's crazy. Like, this is there is just so much in this game. It's amazing. Alright. Hilario, boom. 36. 
Right shoulder, right arm, left arm, left leg. Oh. Yeah. And he also made a another game while working on this game, right? He made the book for uh, the Book of Blood game for the Dread X collection. This dev is going places, man. Because that game was fun too. I mean, it was obviously a lot simpler than this game, but um, it was still. Like, there were still n new ideas in that one. This dev is, uh, is going places. All right, we need to grab everything. Do we have the same setup? Do we, we still have a... Wait, what the fuck? I picked it up through the... Wait, I'm cheating? Wait, how did I do that? How the fuck did I do that? I was cheating. Okay, these are in there. Hacker spotted. And then we have... Oh my god, where did you leave? This one, this one. Okay, this is actually an okay setup because they're all on the, they're all over here. Not too bad. Anything down here? Nothing down there. Do I have everything? Scalpel, I need the, the, the threads. Where are the threads at? There, up here. That's a sneaky spot. Will they update the game? They've already updated the game, and I mean they fixed all the bugs mostly, and now they're uh, they're adding more content as well we over time. I just I just love to play this game. It's just so satisfying. Something <laughs> about like finishing it and getting the scares along the right. way. Just the scares are just so good in this game. Like even if you've seen them before, they're just really fun to watch. Okay, um, now we need to grab all of the stuff. Gotta find the bugs. I mean, everyone was finding bugs when this game first came out. It was... That, that was the only thing. But, I, I mean, I was looking forward to this so much. I played it, like, right on release date. So, obviously, with a single dev, with this much of... This, like, large of a scope, there's gonna be bugs when you first release a game. It's just... Inevitable. I wanna look at the, the true ending a lot more. Like, think about it more. Because back then, I didn't fully understand the whole game yet the whole story oh here we go it's, it's the youtube the age restriction thing again see they give you it so much they once you get to this point they just give you this over and over again youtube you can't look i'm sorry i'm sorry i would i wish i could show you this but uh susan doesn't want me to show you this i'm sorry and now we can get the true ending. Let's go. We just got to get it correctly. We could still get it wrong. Now it's it's for all the marbles. Everything is at stake. Everything is at stake. That's why you... I'm... If... I mean, I'm going to try probably upload it on the VOD channel without the edits. So maybe you're watching this on the VOD channel. You're like, I'm watching it without edits. Haha, <laughs> eat shit. And then we'll see. I can test it on the VOD channel. Wait a minute. I can test it on the VOD channel. And then if it doesn't get age restricted, dude. <laughs> and if it doesn't get age restricted, I can just upload it on YouTube as well. Pick up rain. Oh. Look at that tiny L. It's so tiny. Big L. Not to cheat the system. The VOD channel has been so fun. There's been lots of people discovering the VOD channel lately, and it and it's really fun for me as well because it's just like it's just kind of a therapeutic thing to do that I do at because it's not I don't do thumbnails for that, so I just like kind of upload. It's like a an archive channel, so it's just really satisfying to. Where's the bags? Uh, to upload stuff there every day and just see people like watch it a ton the the time watched on that channel is insane the average watch time i have more watch hours than views <laughs> on the watch where the fuck is the bag oh it's down there like the average watch time of a single click on a on a video like if someone clicks on my video, the average time they watch it on the VOD channel is over an hour. <laughs> That's insane, dude. <laughs> That's crazy. The VODs, the VOD people are 
If you're a VOD frog, I appreciate it. What's the VODs channel called? It's called Insum VODs. There's always, in the description of every video, you can go join the Discord. You can uh, find the Clips channel, the VODs channel, and there we go. the Twitch as well, obviously. Where we're, where we're right now. We're live right now. I mean, it's, this is... We're, we're in, like, four places at once right now. We're both on... Uh, on Twitch right now, and then we're also on YouTube, and then we're also on the VODs channel, and then maybe if, like, there's a demon right now behind me, we're also on the Clips channel. Wow! Never mind. <laughs> Not quite. <laughs> the multiverse, it's growing. <laughs> we're everywhere. <laughs> anyway. <laughs> Close one. All right, I gotta clean the machine. I'm part of the Insimverse. Did you just say don't die, sweetie? <laughs> Excuse me. Digitali, thank you for the three. All right, where are the moisturizer? This is over here, right here. Don't die, sweetie. You did not do anything. You gotta look. Any... Any movement. I'm gonna look for 10 seconds. No. It's... It does it very infrequently. I remember we looked for like 5 minutes and then we saw it once. It's extremely rare. Which makes sense. Because otherwise the game would be too easy. Anywho. On your face. Couldn't do this as a job, IRL. Me neither. I would not want to do this as a job. That'll be the fun. Did he blink? I mean, he has his eyes nailed shut. I don't think he can blink. Bad luck at the end. I mean... We do need to get it correct, because if we get it wrong, we're going to waste our... Or we're not going to get the true ending, obviously, so... It's for all the marbles. Look at this. Look at this shit-eating grin you got going on here, huh? Are you the demon? That's kind of sick. <laughs> well then. A little spooky? Hello there. Why are there? Would this be a speedrunnable game? You can speedrun this game, for sure. It would be a fun speedrun too, probably. Especially with the randomized. Wait. There we go. With the randomized uh, layouts, though, it's kind of annoying because <laughs> that is that's a bit frustrating. Knock knock. I can't. I really want to get the event again. Because that was my favorite event by far. It absolutely scared the shit out of me. When I was looking at the computer and there's an event that the guy, like, that there's some demon that, like, walks from here into the room and then starts running to your computer. It's amazing. It's terrifying. That's my favorite event of the game. Come on, do it. I already got it when I uh, played it for the first time. Come on. I'm giving you an opportunity here. Alright, fuck you. Fuck are you? Come on. I mean, you can watch the first time I played this, which definitely... I mean, the first time I played this, I was really bad. <laughs> but then I slowly became good at the game. It's a mirror. It's a fucking mirror. What's up? What the fuck? Um, this one. There's a speedrun achievement? That's like the... I think the speedrun... I think there's three achievements that I don't have yet. It's a speedrun. Let's see. 
It's probably something with speedrun. I have one hidden achievement. I guess that's the speedrun. Or did... Oh, no, I already got the speedrun. Beat the game in under 45 minutes. So there's a hidden achievement, and there's burn 50 bodies, and then embalm 100 bodies. So there's a secret achievement that I don't have, and then two that are just like play the game a ton. So I don't, I don't think we're close to those. Are we close to those? Let's see. I don't, it doesn't say how much I've already are. burned. Um, I need the bag now, which is under here. Wait, no, I need this machine for, wait. Oh, I need your, did I do your eyes? No. All right. Now we do the machine. The smile though, I know. He's having a grand old time. Okay, dude, I think we found the demon. <laughs> I think we found him. Oh, hi there. It's him. Oh, we can loot the roll ahead. In Billful Reagent. Oh, my me. Miss it what happened? He literally started talking like demon language to us. How did you know? Did you not hear him speak? Can you repeat that, Mr. Demon? No, I already picked I already threw the face, and that was not the hidden achievement. Or well that was an achievement, but I already got it. And other L, you know, and then the toilet is the 100% immersion achievement. If anyone, is there, what other achievements are there? Uh, use the phone. I'm to use the phone right after the body sits up. Oh, really? Trying to use the phone. Also, there's an achievement if you click the computer. Because there's a turbo button on the computer. On the first night, you got to try to get the phone. Okay, interesting. That's one I definitely did not do. So that's the last one, plus like a bunch of uh, getting a ton of um, burnt bodies and embalmed bodies. Cool. We, I could actually 100% this. I don't 100% the game often. The hardest game to 100% that I have 100% definitely is like Terraria, because there's like a million things to do in that game. All achievements for that game takes you like, I don't know, like 500 hours or something. If you can natural play. Um, and then there another. Uh, hello? I need to report a mistake. Again? Person. Interesting. Uh, sorry. Uh, her name's Rebecca Owens. She's 14. She, she, she has a need a PhD problem. to finish that game? It's the only game that I recommend. I, I, I don't know. Uh, she was here at the house. I understand that. I need you to check them. Can I go already? All right. All right. Uh, I'll keep an eye out. Thank you. And boom. <laughs> Stardew Valley, or no, sorry, Fred. Terraria is the only game that I recommend you, even on the first playthrough, you use like a guide, like a wiki. Because that game is just too complex. Why did I jump? I knew that would happen. <laughs> Why the police lights? Yeah, I don't know why the police lights are here. It doesn't really make sense. She's 14 in this cutscene? Yes. 
Yeah, Phasma with jump scares from this game. Hey, I found her! Down here! Wow. He didn't even, like, use his hands to catch the fall. He just freaking face planted, dude. <laughs> He just hit the concrete. He ate shit, as they say. Um, I gotta continue. Oh yeah, we need to do this. Shoulda rolled. He shoulda. He shoulda fell in the water, dude. <laughs> he fell into the back rooms. He hit the ground too hard. Well, I think we already- if we already know this is the demon, right? Wait, you didn't even have to burn the rest of the bodies. Oh, and we get another shit oh, because we have to upside down L, the other L, right? We can do it with this, if this is the right one, at least. And the umbrella, I think we've seen this combo before, maybe? Uh, let's try. If this guy is, like, doing this, like, he was talking and shit, I think this gotta be the demon, so let's figure out if that's the case. Uh, so we're gonna grab bag. Let's see. Do I have the lighter? I do have the lighter. Here we go. Boom. I am here. What? What are you? Who? Where? Hello? You are literally not. You are a liar. You're literally not here. Okay, so that sigil again. Let's see if that's the correct sigil. Did we unlock the computer? It did. We have umbrella, both L's. Let's see. It's always the invidious, dude. Yep, it's this one. It's Govos again. So it's L, upside down L. So it, it's right. L, upside down L, Z. Umbrella. L, upside down L, Z, and umbrella. Yep. Alrighty. That's the- that's it? Oh, wait, that's the wrong Z. <laughs> Whoopsie, guys. Yeah. There's- they are so similar, what the fuck? I mean, not really. The one has a, a little tail. Um, it's L plus ratio. Did I finish this? Like the moisturize. Look at that smile, though. Right. That guy's so joy happy, man. What the fuck? There's a white people happy right there. He's so... Okay, then... Uh, I do not appreciate. What the fuck was that noise? You hear that little squish? Was that you moving your legs? To the ah! you. You're such a demon. Is this the first guy we're in bomb? No, no, no. This is like the third guy. Or something. I don't even know. There it is. I was like, that was the sound. That was the sound of him getting a symbol. Interesting. Okay, well, obviously it's him. He's talking all the time. He's like, there's no, no question about it l l yes okay just make sure once again here we go you're wrong you know it's not Are gonna you sure this is the right yes one? i am you piece of shit put the only pizza in the oven here you go time to leave this mortal realm Be good. I hope. And then we get the true ending and we can actually like fully interpret the true ending. Because it should be. Did you put reagent? Obviously, you can't do it without the reagent. <laughs>
Hopefully. Now I wonder... Yes! Yes! Let's go! Hey, little love. Ben! Wait. Oh. Dad? Okay. I'm here. There you go. I didn't know it's what to right. yet. You're safe. Oh my god. Dad! Hey, hey. Hey, sweetie. It's, it's alright. I ruined everything. No, no. My little girl. Don't do this to yourself. You've suffered enough. If I had been like mom. Exactly. You're not like her, Rebecca. Your mother. She gave up on life long before she died. What happened to me was the result of choices you should have never been exposed to. You just to. fell, right? <laughs> you changed your life. And I'm so proud of you. You changed too. Not before I heard you. Sweetie, you can't do this to yourself. Don't remember me like this. I, I don't want to forget you. If you relive that night over and over, you'll only remember pain. The best of me is in you, sweetie. Aww. I'm with you forever. It's, just, it's such a good it's ending. It's so much. Every day I... I know. I know it's hard. But you know where to go. You've already found it. Souls are suffering, Rebecca. But you can help them. You can bring comfort and closure to the living. And let the dead rest. Yes. Let the dead rest, Rebecca. I love you. Dad. I love you. Ooh, she accepts it. She's no longer being tormented. But how does she still get attacked after that? That is such a good ending. It all comes together. Playing this in one sitting really truly shows you how well put together the story is. So don't come become like mom because her mom was addicted. She fell into that as well. Her mom uh, OD'd uh, and she kind of fell into that even more. Then at the, like, the age of 14, she was already hanging out with like the absolute worst crowd, obviously. And she like, her dad tried to protect her, I'm guessing, but didn't end up working out. And then I don't know if the fall is canon, like if the fall to the face is the way the dad died. Because this, I was, I passed away because of his choices. Oh, it's Paul's music? Wait, really? C Paul's music made the score? I know that guy. I played Welcome to the Game with him. Wait, really? <laughs> Oh, look at that. The world is small. <laughs> anyway, um, this, uh, yeah, I love this game. It's such a cool game. It is probably, or definitely the best game of this year, but probably one of the best indie horror games from a single dev to ever be made. And that is, that is not a light statement to put on a game. This is a really well-made game. The scares are truly scary in a way that isn't cheap because I don't really mind jump scares, but having played uh, a game, or like, I don't really mind jump scares. They, they they scare me, they startle you. But this like gets such a level of dread and like true fear. Like you still get jump scared. Like you still get like a, a short burst of a scare. But then there's like an uneasiness that's left behind after you, you see this scare because like they could happen at any point. You could even miss them. There could literally be someone hanging out. Like we didn't really see a lot of those, like the, the, the events that I missed because I was really paying attention. But you could get like a ton of uh, like stuff. You see clips of that going around of this game all the time that the streamer is playing and misses the scare completely. I missed a few scares when I first played this. And that's just like adds such a level of like replayability to the game. It is like an incredible game and i cannot wait to see more from this developer because they've already showed shown that with these two games that they've made the book of blood which i also made a video on the book of blood if you want to see that one it's just a short game but this was obviously a long game uh, that they can make some awesome games and i cannot wait to see what else they are gonna do in the future so yeah let me know what you thought is uh the replay fun i had a fun time if you're watching this still you probably had a fun time as well my favorite game of the year or horror game of the year and i had a great time i hope they're gonna do more maybe even i mean i don't know if there's dlc for this game it just feels like a package it just feels like a whole thing it just feels like it's done like it feels like it's fully 
made and it's complete. There's nothing that could be added to this. It's just a full experience. The story works and like perfectly. Uh, yeah, great. I uh, loved it. Let me know what you thought. If you're not subscribed, please do so. If you like the video, like it. If you dislike it, dislike it. And if you want to join the Love the Games here in chat, you can join us over at twitch.tv slash instant. Every single day at 7 p.m. Central European time. Thank you very much for watching. I love you. And I'll see you in the next one. Bye-bye, guys. Bye-bye. Have a good one. Bye, everyone. Bye, YouTube.